right, what's going on, everybody? And welcome to the Occult Gaming Channel with me, your host, Bellar Wright. Let me actually change this over here. I forgot I had uh, another layer of music playing on that um, little pause screen there. So just making sure my uh, settings are good to go on the stream tonight. Hope you guys are having a good night tonight. All right, just adjusting some stuff here. And actually, I think these sound effects will go good with the uh, little pause screen. So I'll just bring that back temporarily. See, so yeah, I hope you guys are having a good night tonight. Going to go ahead and get another stream in. Last one um, I did was last week. So I'm just going to get another one going here. Gonna go ahead and post these links as well to see if anybody that I know wants to also join the stream. So just give me a few more moments here. As I post my links. So we're just gonna continue the Dark Souls 2 playthrough. I just had a really strong itch to play it. I've been wanting to actually play this um, since the last time I played it, which was uh, last, oh man, how long ago was that? Was that two weeks ago now? Yeah, that was, that's like two weeks ago now. No, it was about a week and a half ago, last Wednesday. So I didn't want to get back to this. All right, had, had a pretty good week so far. really cool last couple of days honestly all right let's get it going so hope you guys are doing well I'm just gonna put a little what's up in the chat so if any of you guys are here go ahead and feel free to chime in I'm gonna go ahead and get the PS4 view started so what's going on everybody and welcome back to the occult gaming channel with me your host Bellart Wright and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. I was actually able to get uh, this character to finally resemble the main character from my book Hell's Glitch. And this again is another celebration. Um, we're just going to continue to celebrate now that Hell's Glitch is out in stores and um, getting its sales, getting its pages read. Started to get the first of my uh, reviews in for the book, so for the for the re-release of the book. So that's exciting, and um, yeah, I'm gonna use this moment to just bring attention to my book, um, but to also have a little fun tonight. So. Get things going. So we shouldn't have any issues really with um, frames tonight or frame rate or anything like that. Oh, I hate that attack. Yeah, it looks like I need another refresher because I'm <laughs> the controls are feeling a little bit weird to me again. So yeah, uh, again, this is a celebration of Hell's Glitch. Um, and I'm going to just do that for a while because I'm super excited that the book is out now. So again, Hell's Glitch is my book. Um, the cover looks a little like this. Right here. And the sequel is currently available for pre-order. Uh, the first book there is out right now. So you guys can get the first book on Amazon.com right now. And the second book, you guys can pre-order it, and that'll be released on the 22nd of June. So, just wanted to plug my stuff because half the stream is, um, you know, I, I probably wouldn't be playing this right now if it wasn't for the release of my book. Uh, and really, I wanted to play Dark Souls 3, but uh, 2 was the only one I had that was available currently. Not that I'm complaining, I love to. 
I might even like two more than three. So that's uh, that's kind of where I am with it. Uh, two was a lot of fun. I understand why people don't like two, but I really I really enjoyed two when I played it. Let's see. What do I got this set to? Look like I was about to do a plunging attack. He might already be dead though. There we go. Come on. Ah, oh, this moveset for this thing is butt cheeks. Not good butt cheeks. Um yeah so before we dive super deep into it um and apologize i just want to get my cheap plugs out the way uh hell's glitch can be found on amazon.com and you guys can get the direct link to the sequel right there and uh, the character we're playing is this guy who you guys can see a little bit better on the original cover this is what hell's glitch used to look like Let's see if we can open that all right zoom in this is what he used to look like and it's my current guy right there same little equipment there well, similar. They're they're not the same as you can see with the shield, but pretty similar. And the character wasn't based off of um, the character's armor wasn't based off of this character, because I hadn't played two when I first uh, came up with Hell's Glitch, or even when I designed the cover, which um, I designed the cover like after I was finished. <clears throat> I didn't play two until I think I was pretty much done with the uh, with like finalizing the the uh, first book. Cause how'd that work out with two? Um, I played that pretty much once I was done wrapping up Hell's Glitch. I played two like around the same time. That uh, I need to check my Xbox because that'll give me the timeline. I know I played to like around about when Hell's Glitch was already done. And Hell's Glitch was uh, heavily inspired by the first Dark Souls. And then um, when I released Hell's Glitch, number three had came out the previous month. It just came out. But at that point, my edits were done, and I was just waiting for a uh, pre-release, waiting to um, sell the thing. Is a player right here? Yes, yeah, player. Do I have the key for this? Oh yeah, that's the soldier key. Oh shit, there's something. Oh, that's the crystal lizard. Oh, that thing's gonna get me killed if I'm not careful. Uh, shit, somebody got up. Yeah, I'm gonna need a torch. That's a bit rough in there. Trying to see if anybody's coming out. All right, let's get that torch going. I think I have to actually equip it. I know it is one of these items. Oh, do I not have one? Oh, you come, you come with the torch. It's like one of the first items you get. No, it must be a weapon. Oh no, it is over here. I just don't know how to use it.
Yeah, I forgot to use the torch. Um, is it double tap that or? I think it was a uh, press toggle. There it is. Got light it here. It's been a minute. Did I still not get that? I'm like somebody's in here. Small of a shoe. Now this one, I can't remember if this one was a trap. Yeah, the whole purpose of these playthroughs was to um role play as serum so let's let's do more of that i just get so caught up in like playing the game that i often forget uh why why i am playing it so serum is the main character from hell's glitch and i'm actually burning a lot of daylight on this torch here Yeah, these torches are a finite resource. Looks like uh, Malentia left. Yeah. Come on, dude. This thrust only move set is for the birds. So I gotta figure out an alternative to um to that second attack. I think I'll do an R I can't do an R2. I'm gonna have to two hand it. There we go. That's better. That's tight night. This guy here. There we go. I don't think there's anything of value over there. I do want this. I'm like, you can do it, you can do it, you can do it. Yes.
Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, that was a nice roll. Ooh, nice. Ooh, luckily I can't be OTG. That would suck. Oh, he came down. Asshole. So Serum would think about actually using this area to farm enemies. Uh, to farm souls, really. But uh, right now I don't really see a point in doing that. So let's travel to the... to the fire keeper. I forgot the stats that I wanted to level up. I know ADP is one of them for agility. If I do four here, I get some agility. Nice amount of agility too. Um, and Vigor is our HP. We could go into that. We could do at least two more to get the even thousand. And we, we could honestly use more stamina too. I think I'm gonna go th down that road. So, okay, now if we were Serum, again, the stats of Serum are going to think are important. Um, to a certain degree, health, I think getting it to a thousand um, is like pretty good for him. I think he wouldn't mind sticking to like a thousand, so I think he would do this just for survivability. Um, for stamina, he might want to get that to an even hundred as well. Because stamina is kind of a struggle. I think he'd be done with strength. Um, he'd be interested in attunement as well at a certain point. So I think he want to get attunement up to 10 at the very least. Um, dexterity. I think he'd be more interested in getting speed up though. Because dexterity is one thing, but he can already use the weapons he wants to use. And he would want to eventually get dexterity to, to 20, but I think, I think he'd be most interested in this. Like resistance and agility. I think he go with this. In all honesty, speed and vigor. All right. So I want to see if I can power stance right quick. I finally figured out how to do it. Uh, oh, do I not have the S stock? I guess I don't have it. So instead of that, I'll just buy another rape here.
Oh, I'm an idiot. Um, we want this over here, actually. There we go. Ah, there's the power stance. It is still just all thrust. What about the two-handed? Oh no, I just equipped the one-handed. Oh, there it is. There it is. Oh, that's a lot of stamina though. Oh, that's pretty good, okay. And then I get these four buttons to do the one-handed attacks with. Honestly, I think that's the way to go is the power stance. <laughs> thing is, Serum doesn't do this in his book, though. So I'm going to have to be on the lookout for the S-Doc, too. Yeah, it's me again. Which he doesn't sell currently. Oh, no, he does. But I need more strength to use this one. I thought I had the S stock already. Right, I think I got it. Why did I think I had the S stock? I guess it's because he sells it. Okay, well, the only other thing I need is a regular knife, a regular dagger, which I think he sells. Uh, no, he does not sell a regular dagger. Okay. Um, Alright, let's just go. So I think I practiced with the S-Stock last time. Check it out once more. What the hell? Okay. All right, so things betwixt on a giant. Um, we'll go back to the Cardinals Tower. So Sam would just re-explore areas that um, he couldn't open before. Now that he has this key, um, the difference between what Sam does and what I'm not doing now is Sam would also read the item descriptions. So let's go ahead and do that. Yeah, I swear this playthrough is going to start making sense in a minute. Oh, that's so many items. Bone. 
bisque urn. Ah, okay, cool. I wish I paid attention to where I got this from. Oh, rusted coin. check the chat make sure you guys aren't saying anything cool looks like we're good This guy was the Lord of the Giants. Interesting. And the Dragon Rider. Be summoned as a phantom to another world in order to help that world's master for a certain time. You will be rewarded with a token of fidelity. Crack blue orb to invade. I'm just going to dive deep into it and completely role play a serum. Um, Cause half the thing I do is like, I try to consider like what will be entertaining for you guys, which I should definitely consider. But the thing is, um, let me, hold on. Let me make sure the stream's good. Uh, keyframe should be good. Yeah, that should be good. So, yeah, what I'm going to consider, because I want this, I want this playthrough to, to really be legit. I want us to really play through as this character, um, to role play as this character. Um, I'm going to definitely consider what he does. I'm going to take my time, because um, uh, what I want to do is kind of skip these weapon item descriptions, but I'm going to just go through and read them all as, as the character would. Um, but I would try to make this as entertaining as possible, even though I'm just reading here. Bandit's knife, a knife with a slightly broad single edge. Its tip is shaped to leave a wound that won't easily close. Designed for unsavory work. And beloved by those of unsavory oak. Expensive sword. Uh, it's terribly worn, but nevertheless a favorite among thieves. Short sword. Longer than a dagger, but still lightweight. Widely used, and it requires no particular strength. A reasonable choice that will suffice in many situations. Not the thing you take along if you expect to face any serious challenge. 
I wonder what type of sword this actually is in real life. Because I have Kalika using something similar um, in Immortal Kalika, uh, but hers is actually like a Basilar. And I actually got that sword. Um, I got the idea for that sword. Even though it's a weapon that appears in like all types of different RPGs, um, I got the idea for it mainly from uh, Dark Cloud. Because I remember the Basilar in that one. Then I, I looked it up for Kalika. Because um, I remember it was a actual uh, sword from history. Um, just to see. And I saw that it was like a, you know, like a Greek, like a Greek, um, I'm not, I'm not going to call it like a side sword because it's like their main sword. But, um, you know, they would mainly use the spear, but a lot of them would also use the, uh, the, or no, I'm thinking of the gladius. What am I talking about? I'm thinking of the, uh, the gladius. The basilard. Who used the basilard? I got to check that out right quick. Curious. Basilard. Um, origin. Long blade. Oh, they originated in Switzerland. Actually, I didn't look up the uh, etymology of um, Basilar. I think I just looked up its um, proportions. And it was like a lot of um, different descriptions of it. Like sometimes it would be described as a dagger. Other times it'd be described as a sword. It's always found it to be um pretty interesting. The Middle Ages. That's yeah. The late Middle Ages. I didn't know it was a uh Swiss word. I thought it was um French. It is French. So what the hell did Google's tricking me right now? Basil, Switzerland. And they were common in mid, uh, Middle Ages London, medieval London. Okay. All right, sorry for that tangent. Yeah, so I got stuff like super confused. Like, yeah, um, the, the Gladius was the Greek sword I'm thinking about, but the Basilar was like a, I think, because I was thinking of like how I started um, the process because I was looking into I think I was going to give her a uh, I was going to give her a gladius sword but I decided to actually give her the basil art instead so I remember looking up the uh, the gladius as well regardless um, still curious about what the where this sword originated from I'm actually curious about what it looks like too. Like the model of it. This definitely looks um you know what this kind of looks like a almost looks like a basil art actually. Some depictions of a basil art. But not really. Basil art is like more. It looks like a big dagger. But kinda. Kinda, kinda, kinda. Okay. All right, I do apologize. I'm getting uh, all distracted here. So we'll continue with the inventory. Broken straight sword. Oh, so oh, these are two different swords. Gotcha. I'm like, hold on. I thought I already had a broken sword. Straight sword with his blade broken near in half, nearly useless in battle. A scimitar, a small curved sword with a narrow blade. The rapid slashing of the lightweight scimitar Harley allows the victim to catch a breath. Has a sharp blade, but is rather ineffective against uh, armor and hard skin. Rapier. It's really, 
it's kind of not effective in narrow spaces. Client tips. And the wing spear. Okay, and we do have a bow that I need to start using. Immediate options in battle. Cool. They actually tell you in the description here. And we even got a sorcerer staff if um, we wanted to use that. So I just need more attunement and intelligence. I don't think we'll end up spending too much on intelligence. I do want some uh, pyromancies though. And apologies for the car. Okay. Should be looking at their stats too. Um, it's crazy that they don't actually show them from here. They kind of do, yeah, at the bottom. But those aren't really the stats that I'm looking for. All right. I think I'm better off looking at equipment from the equipment screen. This other stuff, though. You can look at this stuff. Currently equipping that. Spell superior to the soul arrow. More powerful and effective at damaging enemies resistant to physical attacks. The strength of this spell is influenced by one's intelligence. Okay, and we got fire arrows too. You with fire, tip with the charcoal pine resin. Fortifies, uh, weapons fortified with fire are effective against foes vulnerable to magic and fire. Such as the undead or beasts. Useful for short term. No magic. Okay. I'll consider that. Also, we can read the bolts too. We got four Titanite shards. Rare to find. We got two keys, Lindgrass key, which we use to open his shop. Okay, and the soldier key. You know what? I didn't um, activate the bonfire uh, down below. Thought I did that, but I didn't do that. So let's go do that right quick. Oh, a shield. Oh shit, I forgot about you. Combos. Oh, Pate's here? I could just use Pate? Wow, I might just do that. Because those guys cost nothing to use. I could have swore there was a bonfire down here. I guess not. I could have swore I remember there being like a bonfire around here. Guess I'm thinking of other Souls games. You know what, let's, let's use them. Let's use these guys. Huh? 
Wait, what? Wait, what? Guess I can use these guys again if, uh, uh, I'm just curious about what this is about. Oh, they can't come in here. That's what it is. Gotcha. Okay, I can come down here and get them to wreak some havoc. I think I'm going to do that. Come down here, pick them up, and have them uh, assist me through the through the area. I don't know if they'll survive the um, the lift, though. <laughs> That's the only thing. Honestly, don't think they'll survive the lift. Let's do it. Oh. Three. We gotta figure out where else this key goes. Oh. I'm not sure if this will even bring those guys back. But this is the decision Sarum would do, because he would for sure be playing it safe. Hey, what's good, Cornelius? I didn't see when you stopped by, so hopefully it wasn't uh, it wasn't too long ago. I am doing great, sir. Doing really good, honestly. That's part of the reason why I'm able to stream because I'm actually feeling pretty good. I think I've done everything I needed to do today, as far as being productive. So. We're going to play some video games. And I hope you are doing good as well. Appreciate you stopping by. Okay. Are y'all going to be able to get on this thing, man? If I can avoid stepping on the button. Okay. No, I'm not going to be able to take him with me. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. I think I'll be able to use them like when um I'll try this one more time. I don't think they can come up here. Yeah, they're gone. They're just gonna make it harder for me. Let me see. Let me see if they can like teleport. I do want to see how tough the enemies get with them here now, too. Uh, okay. His health isn't, like, drastically different. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That 180 is bullshit. Okay, so you are a bullshit artist. Get out of here. It's just not what I want it. There we go. Let's 
Okay, now I gotta... I can actually use this um, item here to send those guys away. I was gonna go down there and go back through the fog wall, but I forget you can just um, do one of these here. Little black separation crystal action. Yes, please. Okay. All right, we'll just keep it going. Whoa. Now this, this is rough. This is rough. You gotta be accurate with this weapon. And if there's one thing I'm not, that's accurate. Alright, Sam will be very careful going down these parts. For one thing, he brings torch with him. Let's go ahead and start lighting stuff with this torch. This first. Actually, we'll just keep going this way, I think. Okay. Okay, make sure there's no ambush action. Ruined Alphys. I don't know who this is. I don't know if this is a player. Probably a player. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yes. I think it is a player. I mean, I think it's the NPC. Oh, you are a light source. They make this really easy for the player. Uh oh. Still got hit with that. Bro, bro. Oh my goodness. Mm -mm. Oh my goodness. That was really bad. Like insanely bad. This here. Yeah, I would have got annihilated if this guy wasn't here. God, the wall, really? Come on back in here. Fight him in here.
Oh, jeez. I hit him again. Oh, you gonna heal? Oh my goodness. Right, this guy's still alive. My knife throwing. The hitbox was so bad, it hit the wall. Oh shit. Oh! oh. Better him than me. Shit, that still hit me. And there's somebody walking around in here. Hmm, trying to get him. But this is a. Okay, this is a good trade. Great. I got a life gem out of it. Lost my support though. So if I go in there and get that, the chance somebody up there is gonna see me, I think. Probably somebody in there, up there, and in there. Herb, green blossom. Yeah, he just like destroyed him. Just <laughs> stand a chance. I think I can um only get in from. Oh no, I can get in from down here. Okay. Proceed very slowly. So I handle everything out there. Okay, there's an enemy over there. Uh, I don't really know which ladder to take. See what's going on up here. These two are waiting on me. These three. Where is it two? Three. These three are waiting on me. Okay, so if I do it from over there, I can at least sneak up on them. Alright, that's what we'll do then. Okay. If I do anything... At least two of them are going to know about it. Whatever I decide to do. Uh, they aren't looking at me right now, though. So I'm not going to be able to parry with these guys. So. Oh, I do got a crossbow. I... Okay, I can dual hand it. If this works out. Uh oh. No, can I not, can I not just shoot it? Uh oh, they know. They know. These guys can't climb though. These I don't think they can. Nope, they can't. Okay. Oh, they're coming though. Uh oh. Shit. Oh, that's so much stamina. Oh, this ain't good. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. So slow. Uh oh. That's cursed. 
All of that is cursed. All cursed. It was a bad decision. They're still coming. Shit. Shit. You know what? If they want to come, they can come. Let's test their uh, resolve. Shit. I think they turned around. Oh my god. That was terrifying. Do they really not come this far? Oh, they're like right there. I can't even see. Oh, wow. Let's see if I can get this one. Just that one. Just you. Oh, come on. What the hell? Uh oh. Okay. Uh oh. Okay. He can't come this far. Oh, really? If you can't do it, dude, I'm just going to take advantage. Oh, that's one in a super cowardly way. <laughs> ah, but that's what it means. Play as Serum. And play as me. I'm not going to hold y'all up. But you know what? They can't climb back up there, can they? I think they're just down here with me. I'm pretty sure they're just downstairs. Yeah, they aren't up here anymore. They're just down there. Holy shit. There's the bastard sword. Soul of a nameless soldier. An effigy. And the whip. Illusory wall. Don't believe so. Yeah, they're down there just waiting. Oh, there they are. Holy hell. Okay, I'm gonna go down this way. Now, the thing is, these guys could loop around and sneak up on me. I really don't want that. So this is a bit of a pickle right here. I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, what's that? Random stuff floating. Left. Hold on. Ambush from the left. Oh, they're talking about left and over. Okay. Yeah, there will be an ambush coming from over there. I saw because of the... Now, those guys can sneak up on me. That's what I'm scared of. This asshole, who cares? One over. Area of left. They can't get in here. Are they coming? 
They coming in here? No, they aren't. They aren't because they can't. It'd be fucked up if they could, though. Alright. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. There he is. He's in now. I just want to make sure I don't get snuck up on. Okay. So he's there. Just you. You I can do. I think. This works for me. Slowing it down. Holy hell. I didn't think he'd just be waiting on me like that. Make sure we got sure footing. Uh-oh. That roll recovery is weird. Cause he like stays hovered down for some reason. I gotta do that and he'll still be like. Oh, there's a little, okay. For like turning really quickly, there's like a little bit of a delay, looks like. All right, all those problems are taken care of. See what problems we have awaiting us over here. Be wary of back, therefore trapping inside a head. Be wary of back. As in what? Be wary of caster. On fire ahead, dark spirit ahead. I don't remember there being anything special about the enemies over here. I remember there being like a quite a few of them. Mostly hollows though. Uh oh. There's a dark spirit. Let's see. Let's get to like an oh there he is. Okay. Do it. Holy shit. Whoa, what the fuck is that? Oh shit. Get up here. What? My attack was so slow. Fuck. Mm. My attack options are so lame compared to his.
Comes through doors and shit. Okay. You dick. His poise is so much better than my poise. Fuck. Hurry up. Dude, hurry up. Gotta run like a fucking bitch. We'll see how he deals with this shit. See if he can deal with this shit. Fuck. Ah, all right. My shit's just like so slow. I think I'm gonna have to switch it up because this weapon isn't doing it. I have to go back with the short sword. <clears throat> I think he's just up there waiting on me. Fucking do it. Hmm. Yeah, he really shouldn't have made me fucking retreat like that. Thought I heard you. Fuck. Yeah, his uh fucking R2 span was beating mine. That's when I know it was a problem. And he and he had the poise advantage. Do it. Oh, shit. Yeah, my stamina is ass. Damn it. What? The blue hell. Come on. Use both ways. Yeah, his everything is just better than mine. How did you? you can eat it, dog. <laughs> Jeez. Ah. Uh... All right. Okay, so he came from like all the way over here. I think there's other enemies here as well. I think there's a... Right there was something over here.
And you can um break treasure chests if you're not careful. Large soul of a proud knight. Hunter's hat. Let's go ahead and check out this uh, hunter's gear right quick. This is, uh, looks like Ferris's stuff. Okay, so we'll get a breather in a bit. Once we clear this area out, we'll take some time to read over our inventory. But uh, this this wasn't a bad little uh a little haul. I think we. Really, we spent way too many healing items here, though. With me just fucking around. Giant, rest in peace. Remember this thing dropping something before? Hmm? Sound like somebody just dropped in. Maybe they just loaded some corpses or something. Okay, that's where I came from and anything interesting over here? Not really. Okay, we got another bonfire here. I'm not gonna use it while I'm here. I'm gonna leave and then use it. And this whole area out here, this is like a whole other area to really explore. Like there's a lot going on over here too. So I'm going to do that, but I'm going to make sure that I'm topped off with healing items. You know, I'm just going to use this short sword for a bit because the, the rapier is, is rough. Is rough because I can, there's certain enemies I can't even attack. Uh oh. Look at that fucking 180. Okay, now if Sam was having as much trouble hitting enemies in this game as I am with the with the rapier, he definitely wouldn't hesitate to switch up. I'm gonna go ahead and continue to use the rapier, just cause I, I really do want to uh, play through this as Sam. And this is just how Sam does things, but I ain't gonna lie, it's a little rough. Um, I'm gonna need some more throwing knives too. Oh, he's coming. I'm gonna need some arrows too. Mm, yeah, I don't think I want to do this just yet until I get some more normal arrows. Because unless I got projectiles, I gotta play their game. Which uh, definitely don't feel like doing that.
So, I guess we can proceed over here just to see what this side has in store for us. If we have the key for this side, we do. Okay. That's where we want to go, for sure. Oh, look at this. Detour. Torch ahead. Cool. And Ring of Restoration. I believe that's, um... Is that the Chlorathy Ring? But for this game? I'm not even wearing the, uh... The life ring. What the hell? Oh, and this one restores HP. Okay. Cool. The effects look so hideous, though. <laughs> I really don't like the effects showing up. I think you can turn that off in the options, though. Game options. Uh, did that do it? Nah, that didn't do it. That cinematic effects, keep it on. Switch. Yeah, I think there was a way to turn the effects off. That might have been like the PC version. Oh, shit. Okay. I don't think I got to worry about that unless I go try to mess with him. Guard Lance. <laughs> All right. Up. Slip up. Amber herb. All right, brother. I'm gonna let you have that over there. In peace. Oh. Okay. We got everything from over here. Um. Yeah. Really, the next step is to go out there and explore. I can't remember if there was any like um anything else up here to try to explore. Yeah, was there anything else in here? Hate you. Yeah, that's right. I could use this to go down there and mess around. That's right. Okay, really, this is the next area down here. I guess I can. Yeah, I can go down here and mess around. Then that eventually takes me down there. Down here really takes me to a lot of stuff. This thing is like so stiff, it's such a stiff weapon. Um, yeah, you can actually jump over there, but from where? Or no, you can, I think you gotta go around to get over there. This leads to ground. Take this, I think I can sneak up 
around it over to them. Fudgy action. Oh shit, okay. Thought I messed that up. Uh oh. Somebody's coming. Somebody heard me. Hey, this shit's loud. Alright. Yeah, Sam wouldn't waste too much time on these loud ass rickety boards. Quite a few of these guys down here. Oh, here they come. Still don't see me. Just a couple of you guys down there. Flying by me. Third one who just woke up. Hey, there's these guys over here. Two caves down here. That cave looks like death. Dead end weakness, dead end. Oh shit, I forgot that thing could do that. Okay, fair enough. Thing is, I'm more um, at an advantage if I take my time anyway, because I got the regeneration ring, the health regen ring. It's much better if I take my time. Okay, I'm definitely gonna level up ADP stat, like really quickly, as quick as I possibly can. You don't want to mess around. All right, I gotta. Uh oh, I try. I didn't want to get splatted. Four. Okay, That's impressive actually. What's not impressive is my slow ass recovery. Uber bad. Uh oh, we almost traded. All right, some good shit down there, but there's nothing I can do about that right now. Life gym. This is how we leave. Eventually, so down here is a pit of 
torment. Sarum would know that, but Sarum would know not to go down a narrow area with nothing but uh, corpses and fire. Sarum would definitely know that to avoid that. Dead end weakness, dead end. Soldier shield. All right. Oh, that was interesting. So yeah, there's some stuff here I think you can like jump to get. Like that, for instance. I don't mess around with Dark, si Dark Souls as uh, platforming, so I, I won't be getting it anytime soon. And neither was Serum. Oh, that takes stamina too. Did not know that. Okay, so the only way out of here really is uh, through this window over here. There's definitely two guys over there. We can we can mess around with that. There's like a third guy here, right? Oh, there he is. That's the third guy. But he's not messing around down here, so I can take my time to take these guys out. There they go. See ya. Oh, that was good. You know, it's not good. My fucking thrust attack, which does not at all home in on enemies. So there is a third guy in here, which I think he's over here. No? Oh, there he is. Complete shit. Oh man. This is gonna be rough, man. <laughs> this is gonna be really rough. Definitely gonna see what the S stock's talking about. I mean, S stock's like more of the same, but I think the reach alone will probably make the S stock worth it. I think we're gonna get some ADP. I think you need like a hundred something ADP to, to max it out. I think Vigor's fine, Endurance, I'm uh, gonna need more of that. For sure, but we'll wait. We can wait on Endurance. Okay. Let's go ahead and um, get that S-Stock. I keep thinking we already have one, but we do not have an S-Stock. Cause I thought I remember um, trying out the move set for the S stack at a certain point, but we definitely don't have it. I knew you'd be around soon. Come on, show me what you've got.
Alright, because I'm going to start upgrading my weapons soon. And I want to not waste any upgrade path. So, S stock right here. So, again, I can't use it with one hand effectively. But it's just it's just a longer um rapier. Oh, and it does have a slash. Oh, I gotta use the S stock. <sighs> I really want to use the rapier, but not having a single like slash attack really kills it. Oh man. I don't think I can use the S stock, man, because just because like Sangram doesn't use it and the fact that it's like partially a strength based weapon, I can't use it as good as it is. And it is it is awesome. It is straight up awesome. That's that slash alone makes it worth it. It takes a lot of um stamina but it's definitely worth it okay all right i'm gonna use the rape here i'm gonna definitely put all my efforts into the rape here but if i start struggling real hard we're definitely gonna switch it to the s stock but for now we will focus on the rape here as horrible as it is. Oh, and this one you can still reinforce armor. I didn't know that. I forgot, actually. Because I don't think I used the armor reinforced too frequently previously. Okay, we're about as strong as we can be right now with the resources I was um that I decided to use right there. I'll be around. Okay, so again, if we start to struggle, I'm definitely switching it up to the S stock. Like not having nothing but like one sort of attack really makes this a struggle session i'm gonna need like a lot of um endurance to make this work Some magic here, so arrow and heal. I'll buy her last life gem. Oh, cool. Now she's just selling them. That's cool. Bright bug. A tiny bug that produces light. Bright bugs are said to comfort the dead and are found in the marshlands leading to the undead crypt. By ingesting a bright bug just before death, the moment at which they glow most brightly, one attains great power for a short time. Often utilized as a last resort for adventurers who have lost their way. Has no effect in other worlds or for phantoms. Oh cool. So this is kinda like a um kinda like a rat ring perk. But the item has it. I'm guessing like you get extreme damage once your health is uh, at critical. That'd be pretty cool. Okay, so at this point, Sam would uh, firmly be farming for various souls. He 
We don't necessarily gotta do that right now. Definitely want more of those. I'm gonna get uh, five more of these. Gonna get mm, eight of those. As many of these as we can carry. I got 11. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna get one of these, one of these, and just one of these. Cool. See if there's anything else here I want to do. Oh, the cat's in here. I didn't talk to the cat. Oh, undead, are we? And one without much time remaining. Just about ready to fall apart, I'd say. Not exactly the time to be chatting with a cat. <laughs> well, suit yourself. Oh yes, you may call me Shalqua. Shalqua. Hey. So, what did you want anyway? Ooh, you smell wonderful. <laughs> All right, we got covenants. Not in a covenant. This place is already dead. Everything will crumble and waste away so that something new may be born. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> you got some ring, ring of evil eye. Reduces damage from falling. That's cool, ring. Easier to be detected by enemies. Easier to connect to players who chose same God. And can hear voices of foes. <laughs> no need to overdo it. Okay. It's like choosing a server. Hidden enemies, that's cool. I kind of want to mess around with that. Probably not as cool as it sounds, but it sounds interesting. This place is fascinating. We receive only the most peculiar visitors. Folk like yourself. It's enough to keep even a cat amused. <laughs> Nothing suited you, I presume. Suppose I should stop trying to break stuff like an idiot. Cause Sarum would not do that. Cause Sarum would uh be very um careful about not pissing off the NPCs if he could help it. Oh, hello again. Uh, I hope you find something of use. In Parma. I do hope I see you again. Right, I can actually talk to him because I didn't uh, 
I don't think I exhausted his dialogue. Because he does give you your first covenant. I am Solden. And like you, I lost everything. And now I'm here. You probably heard that it was possible to break the curse here. Well, that's not true at all. There's nothing here for you, me, or anybody. Do you know much about souls? Even I'm not certain, but I'm told that the soul is the essence of life itself. Anything living, sentient or no, supposedly has one. What we call the curse is traceable to the soul. Do you see what that means? To be alive, to walk this earth, that's the real curse right there. We undead will never die. And that's quite a predicament, really. There are four beings in this land with giant souls. And wherever you go from here, you'll sooner or later come up against them. Each has a powerful soul and a terrible curse. If that frightens you, then you ought to just give up right now. Like I have. Do you ever cry out for help? The journey of an undead is long and treacherous. You will face invaders from other worlds at every turn. If you need help, why not proclaim faith in the Blue Sentinels? When you face danger, the Blue Sentinels will come to your aid. Protection is yours, if you wish. You need only accept their kind embrace. Okay, let's join the way of the blue. Covenant of the meek. Discover the covenant of the meek. Yeah, I think Sam would join a covenant of cool bros. He would for sure want to know what he could get out of it is a wise decision. People are weak, but the blue sentinels watch over us in their benevolence. Let the sentinels cradle you in their embrace. Look at our new neighbors. How they fret over all and sundry. Oh, those were better days. Oh dear me, it really takes me back. Oh, he's talking about uh, Malentia. May you find peace on your journey. All right, well, we did everything we can do so far. Um, In terms of here, uh, but we do got to dive deeper. There's a couple ways we can go. I'm gonna continue exploring. Oh, sorry, I, I don't wanna to talk to you, I'm sorry. Actually, I wanted to go here. Now we could go here, Eats Tower. There's much more to do here. Fallen Giants. Oh shit. Militia's not here anymore. Come on down. Get out of here. 
Actually, there's a couple of ways we can go. We can even go fight the boss. I don't want to fight the boss just yet. But then again, I would have that knowledge and Sam wouldn't have that knowledge. So I think Sam would first and foremost, uh, he would like to do what I would naturally do as well and to fully explore this area first. And naturally, he'd have a couple options. So he could explore down here, and that would naturally lead him to the boss. Um, but yeah, we did all of our exploring over here so far, so I'm pretty sure he would continue in this general area. I'm pretty sure he will continue in this general area. Oh, we got already shooting at us. I wonder what. Where's the arrow coming from? Oh, that must be above me, actually. There's that guy. There is that guy way over there. Oh shit, what am I trying to do? I wanted to get to that guy, which yeah, I can get to that guy from. I have to go back up though. I have to get to him from over here. Blow that up right quick. Okay. You got this guy. You didn't blow that up, man. Bro, you suck. Blow it up. Didn't blow it up. <sighs> now you want to be accurate. Hold on, we can do that. We can do that. Oh, come on. That was too much. That was too far. But the enemy can't survive it. Lame. I, I thought something told me it would kill me, but I tried it anyway. Cause he survived. I was like, okay, well, I can survive it. But no, I don't. It don't work like that. Okay. We must stay in human form or risk permadeath. come down here to come up guess you get on that bridge is the trigger point point. thing with this character you coming out here is his trigger point yep okay getting a little bit more accurate with that so I got this guy he would have been taking pot shots at me. There's the guy over there next. I think there's more guys like around. Let's see, one, two, three. I think they pull out bombs. That guy has a bow and arrow. 
Um, I think there's more guys. Uh oh. Let's see what else we're doing. Okay, there's another arrow guy down there. You know what? We can we can take him out. What do we got going on? There's another guy up here. What? Where's the other guy? Oh, he's over there. Okay. You want to see? Okay, I do want to take him out. I'm gonna expend some arrows. Make that happen. Or some throwing knives. Okay. Let's go. Couple of guys with arrows. Okay. Two guys with arrows. Also, those guys have them too. So I, I can probably assume that all of these guys have arrows this point I'm kind of okay with on over there's three guys there's another guy at the bottom okay so I there's another guy over there you shooting at me okay, I got wooden arrows I think I can pop him a couple of times from over here. There we go. Um, we'll eventually get to him. Yeah, we'll get to him from over there. So. say death ahead yep oh no would you not see that this was here yeah there's nothing really below us for the most part So we can come down here. Looks like there's some interesting stuff down here. And we do have an enemy that I can easily spot from where I'm at. So instead of dealing with that later, I'm gonna go ahead and deal with it now. Oh, he's he got some crazy range on him, don't he? It goes to show you there's not really any safe moments in this game. Uh, oh, I got regular arrows. Just three of them. You know what? We're going to put those three to good use. I'm going to switch over to the bow. trying to hit this guy right he can still hit me though uh oh uh oh I didn't mean to do that right. he's gonna hit me with this one there we go okay would have been nice if I was able to hit all of them. He ain't moving. Okay. There we go. That's perfect. Oh, is he really trying to come over here? Not really. There. All right, 
my stats aren't really so good that I can just willy nilly keep that equipped. But uh, we do have that option to use it at the very least. Okay, so now we can go down. Start on that. Uh, let's just see our other options. Other option is to go across and to start on killing him. I probably should be trying to do because otherwise okay no that's I got some pretty good options here whatever problems I had here are mostly already dead we go down here and do what that's death what does the message say shortcut nah bruh and get me with that. Okay. So I can use this to go around this way. Which gets me to some of the good stuff. Daddy? What? Titan Eye, yes. I just need one more of those to upgrade my sword again. That's death. There's nothing I can do over here. We gotta go back up. Let's make sure there's nothing else over here. This guy's alive. But I killed you. You're a different one. Um, I think that's all water. Oh, I gotta jump this. Holy shit. That was scary. Somebody knows I'm here. Fine with that, as long as it's not two people. We'll come back and get that. Hurrah for revenge. Oh, he is dead. <laughs> revenge. Visions of oversight. This guy wasn't that bad. I guess if you didn't have nothing to really contend with him like yeah I can I can see how he'd be annoying. Loser wall. Ah. ah not today. That's not a loser wall. I gotta do the jump again. Could go down more, I think. Uh, nah, that's kind of a death sentence. Okay. Older required. I think there were multiple boulders. If I recall correctly. Uh, I guess not. I guess there's just the one boulder. I think there's at least two boulders, man. Pretty sure if I go down that way, the boulder's gonna come. Ready for death. Oh, 
Oh, that ghost almost caught a fade. Oh, I'm sorry. I was just daydreaming, I think. My name is Kale. I'm a traveler like yourself. I'm navigating the continent to create a map. Why cartography, you ask? Well, that's a good question. When I first came into this forsaken land, it was uh, a, a curse? Uh, something about a curse? <laughs> How embarrassing. I seem to have lost my focus. But I do know one thing for certain. I have always been very fond of maps. I came to this land some time ago. Drangleic, the lost kingdom. It sounded so romantic. Have you seen Majula? Oh, there's a rather spacious mansion there. I've made it my temporary home. Well, as something of a squatter, I'm afraid. Inside the mansion, I found a strange map, like none I'd ever seen. I believe that it's a map of Drang Lake. Now I'm traveling the land to prove it. Yes, yes, that's it. That's why I came to the kingdom. Wait, no, that wasn't it. Then what? I don't seem to recall. Were you looking for that map? Wonderful. Then you're fascinated by maps, just like me. Shame on you. You should have told me before. Here, take this. A key to the mansion. All right, we got the house key. To meet a kindred spirit out here. Incredible, really, isn't it? Such a map to be chiseled in stone. But one thing, I would not venture deep into the mansion. Now, I can't be certain, but I've heard disturbing noises. Something about it feels wrong. Just be careful, please. I'm definitely going to be venturing far into that mansion. I'll be back in Majula soon. Perhaps we will meet again and discuss maps at our leisure. Okay, let's check out our brand new spanking key. Opens the abandoned house in Majula. Received from Kale the cartographer. In the past, Majula served as a dumping ground for hor uh, horrible things, but is now a gathering place for those who have no better place to go. Seems this house in Majula was the final home for a few such souls. place for people with nowhere else to go be wary of hole yeah secret ahead nah man nobody falling for that well some people lit literally will fall for it fall into it <laughs> oh man okay so that's gonna be our way out doesn't look like there's anything more over here, so we are free to go. And as soon as we can, we're gonna definitely want some ADP. I'm gonna do a heavy investment into ADP. All right, look at this guy right <laughs> here. <laughs> Break dancing. Flash kicking. Oh, he's gone now. Okay, so the next area was the boss. So, of course, Sarum would not know that a boss was coming up. He would pr 
proceed. Oh, well, that would uh clue him in, but we'll keep going. I did want to light the bonfire, but we'll keep going. Like these guys, both of these guys. Attacking through each other. Not cool, man. I thought I could poise through. I was wrong. That's these guys. Get some free souls right here. Oh, he heard me. Never mind. Wasn't the big guy down there? They had big guys down there. Oh, I didn't know there was a... When did he hear me? He must have seen me. Liar ahead. New soldier key. He required or something. Hey, who did you get killed by? Oh, invader? Oh, is it invader time? All right, let me clear all obstacles before I deal with, before I deal with an invader. Assholes out. There we go. Come on, gang squad. There we go, knife guy, X guy. Okay, so the signs have warned me of an ambush. I don't really remember fighting, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, I do remember this guy. Come on. Fucking walls. Oh, I did that. No wonder I'm not two-handed. I could have did two there. Two. There we go. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Be wary of enemy, but boss. Ahead. Oh yeah, I remember. Okay, I do remember that guy. I don't know if it was that enemy exactly, but yeah, somebody's like always right here. Fighting that dude. Shit. Two of these. Two. Really? Jeez. Okay. Visions of bug. Very arranged battle. Oh, okay. But that's clearly a boss. Okay, so there's a ranged opponent. Anybody else over here? Just you. 
Look, I'm right by you. Oh, the name of soldier. Okay, so we got a 100% boss right here. We're gonna require the head. I failed, therefore help me. Weakness, projectile, and short try weapon. All right, so yep. Yeah. Sam would definitely know at this point that there was a boss fight up ahead, and we know now that that is our next goal. So with him, he definitely go and fight the boss. Um, I don't think he uh, dawdle, dawdle on it either. He just go do it. Um, so yeah, we can we can go do that, but. He want to have the best possible chances of success, so he'd uh, he for sure he one hundred percent gather resources. Life jam. Oh, that hit me. Get out of here. Up item, yes. Oh, yeah, I can start lighting this shit up. I believe there's three guys down here. Ow. Yeah, there's three guys down here. He got the S stock, which is the best stock. I wonder if he um drops it. I did get him to uh, get off his square at least. See ya. All right. Okay. I think we're good. I think we got enough healing items. Honestly, I just want to use these souls.
And I think that's really the last thing to do in this area is to fight that boss. So let's do it. Is this guy back alive? We can do a quick kill over here too then. Yeah, I know it. I know it's at risk. Just right quick, I'm gonna take this guy out one more time. I'm going with a clean 5,000. Most likely I'll just be getting like some uh, throwing shit, probably some healing items. And just keep it funky like that. Yeah, but yeah, thanks for joining me, guys. Hope you guys are having a good time. I'll probably go another hour on this game, I think. Because I'm having a good time. I do want ADP as well, so let's actually start with that. To do ADP, probably plus two. Oh, we did ADP already. Hmm, I think I want endurance though. A little bit more stamina. Oh, that used like everything. <laughs> All right, let's see if we got enough to do anything with the rapier. Oh, he sells the arrows. Okay. I feel like I figured that out last episode. Um, I forgot about it. Oh, he has new stuff. Imported hood. Oh, no. This is the stuff I got already. I don't know why I thought that was the... Sell screen. What a buy screen. Just need one more of these. All right, Malencia. arrows from him I'll get the arrows later I think for now I just want some knives Let's see if I get I get three of these I just want one nah I just want all knives give me ten knives cool with that Thank you. Hi. we'll get arrows later Okay. And forgive me for that car outside. Okay, so we're gonna go into this boss fight. I think we're good. I think we got everything we need. You know, I'm gonna actually try something right quick. Oh, there's a player. Trippy Space Queen. Definitely a player. Oh yeah, a little poise break action. Just hit the motherfucker. Okay. Uh oh. 
Looks like Bazuzo from Berserk. See if he comes this time. I think he only comes the once. Oh shit. Where the fuck did y'all come from? Oh yeah, that ADP's on fleek. Holy hell, that ADP is really nice. Yeah, it still has this uh, weird thing here. I gotta figure out how to avoid that. Okay. I can't, what I can't do is like, if I'm facing this way, I can't just try to 180 it. I have to go in like a, let me see. I can't 180, I gotta like go around, flip that way, then go around like that. That's a little bit faster than if I flip this way, then do this, then I'm stuck doing this animation, which is like a hard stop for a split second. Okay, so I came up here, I wanted to take, I wanted to see if I could fight him from up here, which I cannot do. Because I, because uh, I fleed the first time. If I didn't flee the first time, I could have uh, actually beat the boss early. Oh shit, oh my goodness. Of course, uh, Sarum wouldn't know that, that you could beat the boss early like that. That's just a potential, um, potential like uh, alternate way we could have done that. I think I'm going the wrong way. Pretty sure I'm going the wrong way, actually. Oh, you did see me over here. Okay. Come on down, man. Oh, you too? So it's not just the bridge. It's um, just coming this way, period, wakes up that second guy. This wakes up these two. I can avoid these two completely if I took the other way. But either way it goes, I'm gonna have to fight a bunch of dudes to get over here. Uh oh. There we go. I wanna invest in some repair powder, honestly. Okay, so nobody's coming now. I feel like I could get um sneaked up on any moment. I'm just gonna lure this guy out. I could get sneaked up on, but I'm gonna have to chance it. Just need two of these. There we go. Okay. Fair enough, I don't gotta deal with that guy out there. Just two, great. Just two of those. One down. Three of those. Oh yeah, I forgot I can come up here. Okay. Perfect. And again, excuse the cars. They get kind of crazy. This time of night. Alright. So as far as this stuff goes. We don't need that. What I am going to need, potentially. Is... 
to run the fuck away, which I can do with this. One more bomb. So I got my healing items. I got my ranged items. Mm, it's probably not best to use Estus in this fight. But I'm going to do it anyway. Going to attempt to do it anyway. We do have some repair powder. We got the aromatic ooze. I could do a green blossom before I go in. Depends on how good we're feeling about things. So we know there's a boss coming up. I think Sarum would, uh, his plan would actually be to study the boss, to fight the boss and then homework bone out. But I don't know if we're going to have that chance, honestly. So. And there are no phantoms currently to help out. So we just got to go in and do this. So let's do it. We ain't, we ain't gonna go in guns a blazing on the first try unless we get like a uh, a chance to. How many of these do I got? Three. I will use one of these though. Just one. Because stamina is gonna be at a premium here. Holy shit. Too short. Stamina's ass. Help me with that. Uh oh, too slow. Get some more DPS. One more. Alright, we got this. Uh oh. Got greedy. Oh god. Get it. One more.
Ring of Blades. Yeah, I made that fight way harder than it should have been. I was um thinking like he had another phase there, but he actually doesn't. Okay, so we can um continue on from here. Actually. Nothing happened. Yeah, a lot of souls. So yeah, before Serum did anything risky, he would uh, make sure to uh, clear a path and use his souls. For sure. Let's see if we can get this up to an even even twenty thousand. You know what? Let's just make this quick. This guy will put it over. Uh-oh. I was going to eventually get hit. Okay, cool. That's all we need. Take this guy out over here for some free souls. So we gonna level up as much as we possibly can. Bearer of the curse, seek soul, seek the king, lest this land swallow you whole, as it has so many others. Okay, so what do I really, really need? I kind of want, I can go up seven levels. I don't want to get that up to 20. I think we're, we're good for health for a little while. We can keep that at 12 for a nice little while. Vitality is important because we do want to be able to have more equip load. So trying to get this up to like, Probably 10 is what we're going to want it at. But I think even right now, just having a couple levels in, into this is pretty good. Like three levels. And... Oh, we could actually get like a spell slot right here. I think we're going to definitely want to invest in some type of spell slot. But I think we'll get there when we get there. 
uh, for now, I think I want to just do ADP. Two here and two here, like that. Hmm. I think we're gonna want to get ADP up really quick, really fast. But I think this is good. Shards. Over the hill and past the forest is the king's castle, where a man peered straight into the essence of the soul. But whatever came of it, those who come to Drang Lake seeking salvation soon lose hope and turn hollow. It happens to them all, sooner or later. That blue knight at the base of the tower. His spirit is already broken. Although he does offer sound advice. Perhaps he is a foreshadowing of your own future. That tiny thing inside the ruins. An ancient being that will mock your very existence. The cat. She imparts sound wisdom. Provided you find her own. I should have saved money to buy arrows. For when the undead dies, it is never truly dead, but only one step closer to hollow. Not all undead are hollows, but all hollows were once undead. If you find an Estus shard, bring it to me, so that I may ease your burden. Over the hill and past where a man whatever okay if I picked up another soul it's a good time to use it I did not just the pursuer soul okay I need arrows really bad I'm gonna have to come back and buy them for now Knife it is. Thank you, guy. Alright, see you guys later. We're gonna keep going from the Cardinal Tower. Actually, you know what? I could use um the spellcaster guy. I forgot he was down there. I could definitely use him to help me explore and shit. I mean, Spellcaster guy did get murdered, but um, we should be able to summon him again. Oh, fine, fine, fine. You can get up, sir. Oh, God. Let me hurry up over here. This guy comes over. Yep. Shit, you too. Hold on. Shit. Oh, you almost got me. Uh oh. Ooh, if I wasn't careful, he could have. He could have did the deed. Okay, he dropped his halberd. See if I can survive just like this for now. There we go. Skeleton. He was Arius. Please. Yes, ruined Alphys. Oh, shit, I need you to hurry up, Alphys. There you go. Oh, 
awesome. I could have definitely used uh, Alphys on the other side. Oh, he got dark too. Torch. I mean, really, I don't need to. All right, let's get some easy souls, Alphys. Don't uh get murdered this time, sir. Alphys, they heard us. They heard us, Alphys. Yeah, we, we want to come over here, Alphys. They're going to eventually be joining us. Excuse me? Don't come out the door. Uh oh, they're coming. Let's go. Yep. Got one, one of many. One of them fell down. Come on, let's go. Uh oh, one of the fellas. There we go. You guys, drop. There we go. Alphys, you might want to get the hell out the way. Ooh, that hurt. Oh man. Killing it over there, actually. Kill this one. Lame. Who are you aiming at? Hmm. I'm sorry, brother. You you putting in work over there. This archer. Yeah, alphas would have been useful for that uh, invader. Okay, I wonder if he could go the other way as well. So yeah, that item over there was the item. Okay, well, fair enough. Thanks, Alphys. I don't know what task uh, Alphys was tasked with, but uh, guess he completed it. All right, so that's as much as we can use him for. 
he did make that little farm there a little bit easier. Right, so next we go in the other direction. We really weren't supposed to take that that far. And I'm actually a little bit curious. I think Saren would be curious as well as to if we can uh, summon Alphys again, but I, I assume that's going to be it for Alphys. That's just my assumption. Take this guy out. Go make that a little bit easier for ourselves. That whiff. That whiff. Ah, oh, do it. Just do it. Almost. Yeah, Alphys. I think that's it for Alphys. It's not. We can use them again. Cool. Guess we can just use them whenever. Let's see if he follows us up here. We could have probably even used him out there. Couldn't know how good his platforming is. I wonder if he would have followed us into the um the pursuer boss fight. They do a lot of cool like quality of life stuff. Okay. Um Let's go ahead and light this torch uh, over here, actually. And I will light torches over here. Which is not one of these, but this one here. I don't think there was one in here. I don't think so. Uh, sure. These guys. Hey, I'll let you have that, Alphys. Sorry. Ow. I thought there was another torch in here. Another torch to light. Guess not. All right, help me with this one too. souls life gem my office let's get some easy souls there we go jeez that actually is insane See him jump down here. All right, Alphys. Thank you for the backup. Shoot him. No? <laughs> Alright. Man, 
Alright, cool. Thank you, Alphys. For escorting me. Oh, these guys, they weren't here before after the boss fight. Nothing happened. Hold on. Oh, yeah, there was something down here. Uh oh, we'll mess that up. There was something down here. The Drang Lake stuff. That's right. That's right. That's cool. And it's here. It's still above all that stuff. Chest ahead. Therefore, try jumping over here. Chest ahead? No way. Yeah, no friggin' way. Oh, you probably can get over there, but it looks... Huh. I don't know if I trust that. Oh, okay. I messed it up. But it looks like maybe there is something over there. Again, maybe not. I don't know. I'm not that curious to um to try it. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. There's still more stuff to do here, but um, we'll keep it moving. What do we got to do here? We got... New area, what time is it? We'll go another half hour. All right, brand new area, Lost Bastille. Lost Bastion. We already got some good stuff here. So just a reminder, guys, that um, again, I am celebrating the release of my new book, Hell's Glitch. Uh, it is a an awesome lit RPG book slash game lit book um, with some sci-fi and some uh, some uh, dark fantasy elements, um, heavy dark fantasy and um, a light smattering of sci-fi as well. The premise is set up with a, um, a sci-fi premise with a little bit of... Um, a sprinkle here and there of maybe some supernatural. Um, and the book looks like this. Like this here. Um, and it is currently out on Amazon.com. But we also have the sequel that is currently available for pre-order. That's Hell's Glitch Into a Dark Adventure, uh, which is volume one of Hell's Glitch. And Hell's Glitch to Glitch Fringe, which is volume two of the Hell's Glitch series. And you can currently find these books on Amazon.com. Let me get, let me show you guys where I'm at. And we also have the Audible version available on Audible.com here, as you can see. And I did get my first uh, rating, first two ratings. Uh, looks like one of them was a low rating, but I did see this other one here uh, was kind of mixed. It was probably like a three or 3.5 
so uh got some mixed ratings but uh i'm pretty good um they at least gave my narrator a good performance on that um but the story is pretty cool uh previously i did have 44 reviews on it um and i'll show you guys the old cover here actually i got 49 ratings in total an overall four star on it or a 3.8 a uh, mostly positive um even though my initial reviews on that one was um was uh the initial few reviews i got were uh fairly low and it took some um some new readers to make it overwhelmingly more positive than negative so i do appreciate those readers and reviewers um but yeah this is the old version of hell's glitch um and i'll show you the old version of all the books i have so far for for it um well they're only showing one but they showed it was like a series of three books but it is what it is uh, that's the old Hell's Glitch series. Uh, and I'll show you the new books, which pretty much already saw the cover for them. Uh, this is that same book there, but I have updated it with a brand new prologue. And I have gone through line by line and updated the text as well. Um, so the text um, does read a bit smoother. It is a bit faster. Um, but there's also simultaneously more going on. So um, that's cool. And like I say, the uh, second book in the series is available for pre-order. Um, both of them are currently two ninety nine. dollars um, And along with those books there, I also have um, in the Hell's Glitch universe. Actually, let me go back to the Hell's Glitch page. If you just click on this here for the Glitch Fiends, um, you can see that Immortal Kalika is related to that series. Immortal Kalika is a spinoff series of Hell's Glitch. Um, you guys can check that out if you like Souls likes. All three of these books um, are in the Souls like genre. If I did make a video game based on, on them, they'd be Souls like video games. So check those out. Those are really cool. And like I showed you guys, the audiobook is also available. Um, yeah, I'm just having fun um, getting back into Souls likes. Actually, um, go ahead and click this away. I actually um, started the channel off with Dark Souls 3 uh, right after I was done releasing my book. Um, about a month after, I, I finally was able to calm down and play some video games. And I um, uploaded those video games from my PS4 to the uh, to YouTube. And that's the first content I ever uploaded back in 2016 to YouTube. So that's the very start of the channel. I was very bad at it. Um, and I had like a lot of episodes of that and I did it like, um, in initially like five minute chunks. Then I, no, it, it was like 15 minute chunks. Then I finally upgraded that to, um, no, I think it was five minutes enough. I, I upgraded, I upgraded it to 15 minutes. Um, I initially did all the, uh, dark souls three playthrough in those like five to 15 minute chunks. Um, and it was like over 200 videos. Like, I think, um, if not 300 something, it was like very close to it. I think it was over 300 some videos though, but don't quote me on that. Um, but yeah, I, I got rid of like a lot of those videos. I only kept like the ones that I, I was, I had the most that, that I felt were the most entertaining. So some of those are still on the channel, but, uh, I did delete a lot of those videos, unfortunately. And light that up. Let's see what they got in here for us. Human effigy, which will be very useful for serum. And dull ember, okay. Okay, what can we use that for? That dull ember. What exactly is that for? Dull ember, a ember that radiates a dull light. An ember radiating a dull light. This flame seems nearly uh, exhausted, but exhibits an eerie resilience. Perhaps this is its ordinary state. So that's this. And as we see, as we can see, we do have a brand spanking new area. So before Serum explore the new area, I think he would master his previous area. And in Hell's Glitch, Serum actually didn't have this problem because um, he only had one area to attend to at a time. Uh, I 
I think we'll just keep going. Um, Forest of the Giants. Crestfallen's Retreat with Cardinal Tower. Yeah, Serum didn't have that problem because he took part in um, what was touted as an alpha test. So only one area was available at a time. Um, but afterwards, afterwards, um, he did have access to two areas, two really big areas at that. So, so where to go next? I pretty much explored all of that as much as I can so far. Yeah, I honestly think we did explore everything here now, finally. If there was anything I didn't explore, it's because I literally can't go any further with it. Um, explore all of that area. Explore it upstairs. Go down here. You know what I didn't do? I didn't do those, like, the Pharaoh's Lockstone stuff. But at this point, Serum wouldn't even know that... Serum wouldn't know that the Lockstone stuff led to, like, main content. He definitely wouldn't know that. I know you're gonna get up. But that's cool. Oh, you're not gonna get up? Oh, you get up when I go over here. That's your thing. Okay. So I did all of that stuff over there. That did lead to a, um, Firebomb. I did all this stuff over here. That just led to a few pickups and the NPC. Um, I could do this stuff down here, I guess. Not really. Okay. Yeah, I think I pretty much did everything here. Uh oh. Okay, I got you, buddy. Wonder if I should have went the other way instead. Probably. Yeah, I should go the other way instead. But he could actually end up hitting me off this fucking stage. What? Two-handed. Two, three, four. Hmm. Visible wall. That thing's powerful. He's trying to get around it. I'm trying to get around it. All right, fair enough. Let's go. So is this this shit down here? Oh no. Oh no, it's not. Uh oh. Oh, I think this is something else.
Oh no, this is down here. Still locked. So, so, so Pate's gone. Pate's just straight up gone. You're just supposed to hop out the elevator to get. Nah, you can't do that. Off range battle. Okay, now I'm actually curious about what else there is here. So like I said, I did everything here. Did everything here. Uh, if we go up. And we just have more here. He's going to be coming any minute. Yep. Should be up to yeah. Oh, the ragdoll. Sneak up on this one. Yeah, the extra 16 and um, or the extra two points in dexterity really helped out, honestly. Uh oh. So I need a Pharaoh's Lockstone to uh really push this conversation along in this area anyway. Still got me. Bastard sword. Yep, I need that feral slack. I might be able to open that door though. Door that's down here. Okay. Hmm, I do have the torch. I think I want to actually start using that. These guys are out. Okay.
Okay, here we go. Hurry this up. Oh, there's a torch up here, right? She doesn't look like it. Fair enough. And again, apologies for the car. Liar ahead. I believe that there is a hidden hidden wall here. But maybe you can only use it if you got the uh, ferals. I guess so. Can I use the key here? Does not open. Actually, I think you can kick this door down. Oh yeah, they have to do it. That's right. They can open it. Yes, I think they can. Yeah, that's how it is. Couple of you guys. Uh oh. Oh yeah, there are three of you guys. Come on down. Unfortunately, uh, that's not something Sarum would know. So I do apologize for that. That's something I. I I figured out a while back. Sometimes you just get in the groove of playing and just that happens. All right, as a matter of fact, let's light this right quick. So I can see what the hell I'm dealing with. Pool of blood, read the message, pointless ahead. Let's ahead, touch pool of blood, cause a bunch of enemies are here. Life. Let's see. Okay. Cool. Life ring, large titanite shard. Dark spot, woman required ahead, what? Oh, ha. I get it. It's kind of a creepy place, though. Yeah. Creepy little corner down here. Okay, cool. We put that out. So we got the life ring. Pointless ahead, which means must mean that it's the same ring I'm currently equipped with. Yep. Now I just got two of them. So if I wanted more HP, could uh use this. It actually doesn't raise your HP. Ah, you can't equip two. That's funny. It is pointless. Hello. Oh my goodness. That's rough. Okay, so this guy could still kill me with a few well placed uh, counter hits. Just like that. Jeez, he was going in. He did want to. He wanted to end me for sure. 
Okay. Dude, I thought there was um something else here, but I guess not. Thought there was something I forgot about. So one eleven. Let's get our bestus back. We'll keep it moving. Uh, I probably want to make sure he's not a problem from over here. Mm, all right, we'll deal with it later. It's fine. Not here. Yeah, he probably poked you right off. Now, I remember there were some enemies uh, below that I had to deal with with projectiles. Um, I think Sarum wouldn't know that, but I think Sarum would try to take this guy out from a distance. Pretty sure he would. I think this guy has magic, though. I think that guy can throw fireballs. Hold on. Uh, let, me make, let me make sure I'm projectiled up, actually. But we can take these out. We can take that out. I'm going to chuck some bombs today. He's a little far. Okay, I mean, that's that's no problem for somebody like us. A little distance? That ain't, that ain't never stop nobody. And I got the wood boats. There we go. Okay. I can aim with this. I can shoot with this. Come on, debris. Hit box. Make sure I get him when he's not moving. There we go. No, you know magic. Uh, this stupid debris. No, you know magic, bro. This debris is gonna stop my arrow 100%. My bolt. I knew it. Let's see if this works. Not far enough. Ah. Uh. Ah, man. Ain't, ain't no pepper on that. Okay, whatever. Let me move on. Uh, I think Sam would want to take this guy out, but this is like a losing battle here. Oh, no. There we go. Actually, this is better. Come on, lure him again. Yep, getting closer. Perfect. Hey, here I am. Here I am. Come on over. Aw, oh, man. Come on. Aw, oh, shit. Okay, never mind. I definitely don't like to waste resources like that. Um, that's so weird. Uh, 
Oh, he's trying to come over here. I'm not having any luck with it, though. Oh, my goodness. Okay. A couple ways we could do this. Boss, and there's something quite ahead. Well, boss. These guys. Pressing the wrong shit. Let's see if I can get this actually. You can actually knock that down and cause it to explode, which is a little bit more fun. He's the only one in here I gotta worry about. And then down there is like some dogs and shit. There we go. There we go. That was brilliant. Anything else down there? Doesn't look like it. Although I do hear voices. I think I took everything down there to out. Okay. Let's see. Equipment. Get my shield back. This a hundred? Yeah, this a hundred. How heavy is it? Six. Up from one point. I know there's a lighter shield in here for sure. Yeah. No, that was all of them. Awesome. All of them in one shot. Okay. He's out here. I try to annoy him as best I can. Uh oh. You know what? Okay, better off fighting him up close, actually. Okay. Now, I remember getting surrounded for some reason up here, right? I think there was like one dog out here. There was something about out here that I didn't like. Visions of man butthole. For rolling. Be wary of behind. Oh yeah, that's infinite. Infinite darkness. Uh oh. Oh shit. I ain't ready. Oh, he's leaving. Okay. You can fight a pursuer there. I want to fuck it with it. Oh, we'll just keep it moving. We ain't doing no secret shit, no extra shit, nothing like that. A pursuer will meet you probably in New Game Plus in different areas. All right.
Let me out of here. Can I go back over there from here? No. Nah, not even from here. That's where Luca Till was in the original game. I'm not sure about this one. Yep, she's there. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't fuck with Luca Till, please. I'm gonna have to take him out so I can even have this conversation. Okay. Sir. Okay. What is it? I don't know you, and you don't know me. Things are better that way. Normally, people keep a safe distance when they see this mask. But you... I'm called Lucatil. From the land of Mira to the far east, across the mountains. They say Drang Lake brims with powerful souls. And so I came to claim my share. But what a strange place. Even the rumors did not prepare me. are an odd one indeed. I've always made a point of avoiding people. While you've made a point of engaging me. I can see that you are mid-journey. If you require assistance, I will help you. Thank you. I come from Mira, a land of knights. My sword is always ready. Don't hesitate to call upon me. Whatever happens, I won't be missed. <laughs> are an odd one indeed well you've made a point I, can, I come don't have antiquate key rear and then thrust come on man show some damn respect put some respect on Luca Till's name all right what we got here Very old key. This key is very old, but in very good condition, such that it should still function. Only what lock does the key f does this key fit? What lock does this key fit? Hmm. Ah, yeah, there's definitely a way up there. From above? From... Unless there's some type of invisible staircase. Hmm. There is this here. Oh, you can try to get up here. Okay. Let's attempt. Hopefully not die. Cool, we done it. Large Titanite. Oh, I wonder, can I uh, torch this? Oh man, taking all the fall damage. So I would have to come through all that with the torch. Um, luckily, there's a save point down below. Sarum wouldn't know that, of course, but unfortunately, I do know that. Uh, so we got Sword Bros over there. Um, does Sarum even have a binocular right now? 
if we do, I need to be using it. Looks like we do not currently have a binocular. Two of those, I need three of those. Okay, I currently don't have a binocular. These guys are over here. It looks like if I go over, I oh, know I can get back if I go over. Uh, let's see if we can firebomb. I don't think we can really, but we can try it. Nah, not really. No fuel. Okay, so are these guys gonna ambush me if I come over here? Be wary of trap fire. Uh oh. Oh. So if I go down here, these guys are gonna set a trap. These three. I don't think Serum will wanna let these guys uh live if he's gonna try to walk past them. I think he would try to take them out. And for some reason they can't see us, so we're gonna set up on them. I need more arrows, honestly, but five bolts is plenty. We'll just use it. We'll just use it. Hopefully this damn debris here doesn't get in the way. Yes, yeah, not air coming. Fine by me. Um, let's try to take this fight away from Luca too, please. Okay, they're coming. Great. Uh oh. Oh, they can take me out. 227, by the way. Not a daily number, but that's a number we have seen a little bit frequently. Um, I think we've seen that number frequently in... Kingdoms of Amalur recently. Okay, so we got two of those guys. Um, whoa, I didn't mean to press that. So now we're, we've hit a bit of a stick, um, stick in the mud here, or we've hit a um, sticky patch. Um, I know that there's an ambush awaiting me over there. Um, but Serum doesn't know that. So I think Serum will proceed um, as cautiously as possible to try to not get this guy to see him. Of course, if he stood here and that the guy was like, you know, nor had normal vision, he would be spotted instantly. Serum would be spotted instantly. But uh, going off of that, just going off the game's physics, we're going to try to um, sneak up to this guy as calm, cool, and collected as we can. Well, let's see what we can do. I think we can pluck him with a throwing knife. Um, There doesn't seem to be anybody around us. There doesn't seem to be anybody hanging off the ledge on this side, at least. And Serum can't spot anybody over there, so Serum will go for it. Oh, you can't go over here now because you need the, uh, the branch now. Okay. Before, I think you could do this like right away. You can go in there. But, uh, hey, not this time. Uh oh, Ooh, I almost, almost botched that. Okay. So again, I know there's an ambush of dogs up ahead. Um, I would just proceed slowly, however, wherever you slice it. Blood stain. Oh, that's him. Hmm. I feel like this is a great place for an ambush.
Like this is a tremendous place for an ambush, like a uh, invasion ambush. Okay, I thought he started walking towards me. Okay. I'm gonna take him off from a distance. Got it. Okay. We need that. All right. Visions of destroy. There's some dogs. I was wondering, I'm like, I'm kind of overdue for some dogs here. Oh, what did he do? Make me bleed? A little bit of bleed action. Okay, things are a little bit different. There's no dogs up there. There's just these two down here. Fire lit. Locked. This is also locked. We can open that from the other side. We sign will go in, guard up. Okay. And we can light that up. Let's do that. Actually, let's light all this shit up. Honestly, before we bring the enemies back. We can go back up and light that torch. I honestly think there's two torches to light up here. Alright, let's be careful. There's some pitfalls over here. Careful again up here. Uh oh. Okay. Please. Please. Footing, don't fail me today. Ugh. There we go. Sometimes controller be spazzing out, so you gotta be really careful. Right. Shortcut. Oh, cool. Um, is it really though? Nah, y'all fooling. Y'all really fooling. Okay. Yeah, y'all really fooling. I was just trying to make sure that there was no other thing to use the torch for over here. Doesn't look like it. Alright, cool. You know, I'm gonna come over here and challenge the um Oops, no, I didn't wanna do that. Wanted to Nope, didn't wanna do that. Just one time. Yeah, there we go. There's no torch over here. Oh shit, I didn't mean to rest. Damn it. <laughs> Did not mean to rest. I was trying to, uh. In my mind, I was toggling this. That's not what happened. Anyway, set this light. Hopefully, this doesn't attract any dogs. Doesn't look like it. Let's talk to him first. <laughs> oh, why can't they all be this easy? <laughs> Ooh. Mm. We've got a wild one here. Shape up. Shape up. 
So, hand that ember to me. Right now, you imbecile. Ah, well, if you put it like that, take it. Oh, to infuse. Right, 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 right. We can start infusing stuff. Uh, and I have none of these stones. What you got, McDuff? Doof. Uchigatana action. Great X. Longbow. Royal Kite Shield. Just need a little bit more strength for that one. How much does this weigh? This just weighs four, which which is actually pretty decent. I might have to come back and get this. Um, the first things first, though, I'm gonna buy some arrows for sure. There is this large titanite here that he sells. That'll come in handy as well. It's an iron arrow. Does this weigh anything? These are 30. Oh, I can, I can buy like almost infinite amount of these. Uh, yeah, let's get like 50, I think. Oh no, we can, we can do a hundred. That's fine. We can do a hundred. That's like a thousand souls. It's no big deal. I think I will take some of these. I'll take like 25. Cool. As far as bolts go, I'm not going to mess with bolts. So now that I can afford arrow stuff, I'm going to just use that. I got a repair powder and a large titanite. Looks like he sells. I could just start buying those when I need them. I don't really need them right now. Reinforce. Still need one more Titanite. Could start fortifying his armor, but we'll wait until we know the stuff we're going to be equipping. So I'll give a little bit of time before I start infusing that. Some iron arrows. Large titanite. Sweet. Regular titanite. Sweet. Actually, let's, uh, let's do this right quick. Force that rapier to plus three. All right, and then we also have enough to continue to upgrade this, so I'm gonna do just that with these large titanite shards. And look at that, it actually goes up to level. Oh, never mind, I thought that went up to level B, but it's already level B. Yeah, we'll just we'll just do that again. I'm fine with that. Large one, then we'll use another large one. And matter of fact, we'll buy the large one that's here. And we'll freaking use it. All 
there we go. And we were already at plus six, so. Already Saren with the, uh, the smart. Leveling up. I think endurance is like something to really invest in at this point. Because without endurance, I can only get two, three, four, just four normal attacks. Um, and two, three heavy attacks. And then what, two heavies, and two normals. Yeah, I need more endurance. All right. So yeah, there's really nothing else I could do here without a branch of yore. Yes, yeah, that's pretty much a wrap on that. Actually, let me, uh... oh, he moved over here. Do I want to open it? Nah, I want to keep that closed for sure. All right. So if we want to go somewhere new, we have to actually start at Heat's Tower, I think. Yeah, we got to start at Heat's Tower. he doing holy shit he's moving over here holy shit he's coming over gotta take him out first holy shit holy hell oh no oh no oh no oh no oh no holy shit no, I need some allies this ain't gonna this ain't gonna work. What the hell happened? Why are the the shit? Why are the heat knights moving now? Is it because the pursuers after me? What the fuck just happened? Oh shit! I'm gonna need this guy. I'm gonna need you, good sir. Shit. Oh shit. Sorry, Lincor. This ain't good. Damn, I can't run? Let me run. Jeez. Glencore. Yeah, we gotta um Okay. Hmm. Sorry, Glencore. Ooh, I need to make sure you live. Okay. Holy hell. Glencore's down. Glencore's down. Hurry up. Okay. Glencore is down. Come on out. Whoa. We out. 
Man, these buttons is killing me. Come on. These damn heat nights, man. What the hell? All the heat nights are activated. Liar ahead. Just speak up if you're in need of miracles. Not in particularly. That's why I'm here, after all. Why did I come here? Well, do I need any other reason than to spread the gospel of miracles? My preceptor always said this art should be shared with the world. And such is my only wish. Sometimes I fight the urge to pack up and go back home. It is... Well... I must do this. And being out here all alone only makes this a more fitting test of my fortitude. I expected this cathedral to be bustling, but there's hardly a soul to be found here. Without any goings on, I'll have to move soon. To a place I could gull the... <laughs> Sorry. Help the gullible by teaching the good work. I expected this cathedral to be bustling, but there's hardly without any goings on to a place I could go. Sorry, no need for miracles. The gods frown upon us. All right, so there's more to be done below. Mm, there's also more to be done over there, but I guess I'll come back to do that. Because uh, doing it from this direction is a little, a little rough. Then again, actually, no, it should be okay. Because I'm thinking that uh, fog wall is going to be there, but it actually won't. Because uh, cause I didn't summon Glencore yet. I think the... Uh, yep. The heat knight's already activated. I'm gonna see if I can take him on one on one. It's not the best I Oh no, it's the Okay, I thought I heard the pursuer too. Oh no man, we can we can do this. Oh, you aren't that strong. You're okay. okay. All right, that's a heat night. Tough, but nothing too crazy. I need you over here. As soon as I walk out, that's more problems. Just do it. Fuck. I hate you so much. Please get out of here. Okay. I hate you so freaking much. Okay, let's get Glencore. Okay, the mist is back. Yes. Then I'm gonna come back for this chest here later. There he comes. Come on, Glencore, let's do it. Hanky panky, let's get some ganky. Oh yeah. Yeah, Glencore is like King Herc, man. For sure. Glencore. Got your back. There we go. 
Brilliant. Brilliant. Got one more. Shit, the sweep on that. It's crazy. Okay, so there is a heat night in there. We're gonna come back this way. We're gonna go the long way. Take everything out. Careful, Glencore. That's awesome. Shit. Ooh, that's awesome. We did it. We did it. This asshole's coming. I'm right here. Come on. We done it. All right, Glencore. We're doing it little by little. Piece by piece. Little by little, piece by piece. Careful over there. Okay. Oh, we're gonna conquer this area. Got big plans for you, Glencore. I'm gonna lure him over here, actually. Careful. I'd rather fight him over here, Glencore. Let's do it. Oh yeah, come on over. Glencore, let's just do it over here, man. Let's just fight over here. Alright, cool. Who's this cool guy over here? Wagner Sir alone. Luckily, I didn't activate the uh, second sentinel. Don't fight here. Don't fight here. This does not benefit us in the least. Shit. There we go. All right, going for. I thought there was another one up here. Lucery wall. I almost believe you. I almost believe you. Oh, you made me do it. You made me do something stupid. Clicking on random crap. Divine blessing. Are you ready? I sure am. Uh oh. Not ready for this heat night. Sniper spot. I gotcha. Oh, this one must be an asshole. Looks like it. Oh, this one's an asshole. Oh, God. I'm Glencore. Okay. Was oh, that a dragon? Holy shit. Hold on. There's a fucking dragon up there. 
Holy shit. That wasn't there before. Uh, Glencore, I think. I think we're all matched, buddy. Try leg. Oh, oh my god, of course. Through the brick. I feel you. You know what? It's not a bad idea. Try leg. Can't do that. What about if I was over here? Oh, do I gotta cheese this thing? Hold on, let me let me let me get some cover going first. Okay. All right. Let's see. How cheesy are we gonna have to get here? Dangerously cheesy. Let's see. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's coming. Where is he at? We can take flight and like. No, he didn't take flight. You can just fire fireballs from over there. Let's see, I think we can hit the wing from under. Huh. What about this? No, not close enough. You gonna do you come over? I got him over here now. I think if you shoot him. Oh, okay. I'm about to get double fucked up now. Hmm. Those fireballs pretty accurate. I mean, that's doing like a decent amount of damage, actually. I don't think I'm going to mess with that tonight. I'm just going to wait. Looks like I can hit him from like over here. Nope. Yeah, we're just going to leave that alone. Now, Glencore did help us um get a lot of souls, though. Since I got him here, what I'll also do is mess around with this uh, chest here. <laughs> is that the heat knight? Ring of binding. that do oh, I got the blue seal here increases HP slightly uh, the way of the blue is not is not a developed re religion uh, it is a humble prayer that spread naturally amongst those seeking help when apostles of blue are invaded by dark spirits they can receive assistance from masters of other worlds ring of binding an unusual ring of unknown origin limits the wearer's HP reduction when hollow 
Alas, this ring will not make you human. What is lost is not easily retrieved. So yeah, you know what? Let's get some additional HP. Let's definitely equip this ring of blades. For sure. And this uh, covenant ring too. And I'm, I'm a little heavy, a little more heavy than I would, would want, but it's actually okay. I'm gonna use this. Head back to Majula. Good old poise. I would love the stamina, but 10 on that is fine for now. And I would love more equip low as well, because that would actually increase our uh, I need four in attunement to do any sort of extra spells. So I think that's going to be my next level up. For now, I'm going for Vitality so I can um, just equip more stuff. Tactics. That goes up a lot if I do that. Two, three, and then what? Slowly level up some of this other stuff. And with this, I can equip like one additional weapon. And some of those shields, too, which is one more strength. No, we'll go with ADP. One and ADP as well. Or you know what? We'll put we'll put vitality at um, fifty five because I do want to be able to I do want to be able to uh, equip some stuff and to hold on to some stuff as I'm and I need that under twenty five actually. So, how much HP do I lose if I take this off? Just a little bit. That's fine. We'll just take this off. Oh, I'm still not like my roll is still pretty heavy. Okay, I guess it don't matter. Take the extra HP. All right, let's keep it moving. We're about done, but I'm having a little too much fun. I do need to get up early. Let's 
Let's just keep it going. Hmm. Okay. That's this. Like there's got to be something I could torch in here. It's probably coming up, actually. Monastery charm. That's a dead body. Uh oh. Why? Damn. Doing a lot of damage, thank goodness. shit going on down here. Dark Truches. Human effigy. Soul of a Proud Knight. Old Knight Halbert. So some knights have definitely lost their lives over here. Thought I saw something. Light playing tricks on me. There was like one more knight to fight down here. One more of the giant knights. Be wary of tough enemy. Lest they change things up. Oh, they did change things up. Enemy ambush up ahead. Huh. So if I go that way, this guy's going to ambush me. I think, think that's how that works. Okay, nobody's directly above though. But if I run over there, maybe it pulls somebody else to me. Let's see, let's pull him. Nope, no pull. He's just like, don't go this way. Okay. So what? Uh, he moved a little bit. The lane moving. Okay, no, he ain't coming over here yet. So we'll go this way. It doesn't look like nothing too crazy going on here. Liar ahead. Overwhelming, but try hope. What's going on up here? Bonfire ahead. Enemy required ahead, then enemy ahead. Message. Message ahead, then try message. What is this? Uh, we gotta be wary of ambush. Oh, this is the water part, okay. I do remember this part. I remember there were quite a few enemies in this part. Enemy over here. 
Oh man, it's dark as hell down here. Should we not get invaded on? There we go. I see you. Peace here. Oh, that kind of his body hitting the water. A little jump scare action. Okay, I'm not looking at the water close enough. Can't can hardly see it really. Dark as hell down here. Uh oh. Those fuckers. Damn ghosts. Okay. So I know what I'm gonna do. I got throwing knives, I'm not afraid to use them. Holy shit. Okay. Nah man, don't knock one down. Come on over. Should've just thrown another one. Come on, bring that health bar over. Okay. You moving? Nah, I ain't moving. No. Can't even see down here. I'm not going over there, because I don't know if that's like a... And I do see him. This is another... I do see those eyes over there. Hold on. Before I do anything. Stop it. Oh. There we go. So it's weird when it's backwards like this. But oh, as a human. I straight up thought that was a uh, eyeball creature. Bro. What was that? What the fuck was that? Oh shit, oh, that scared the shit out of me. Definitely thought something had jumped in behind me. Alright. So I need a branch of your, I believe, to unfreeze those statues. But Sarum wouldn't know that. That's the tough part. Nothing I can do here. Uh oh. Can't see shit. Wagner, sir, alone. <laughs> I wonder if this is somebody I know. Wagner, sir, alone. This must be somebody I know. Who's watching me and putting down summoning signs? That's hilarious. Uh, help me. Would that I could. Wary of monster. Yeah, I remember there is some type of creature coming up. No man's wharf. Where is this guy? Chucking arrows at us. I guess you know what? There's nothing else we can really do. Uh, back over here.
There was really nothing else we could do. Um, was there anything we could do upstairs? I don't think so, because I think there was a thing blocking the door up there, too. So we only got a few select things we could do in these areas. Um, you know, I do want to actually go back to the elevator, though. I feel like there was like one more area up here I didn't really explore. I just ran all the way here. So was there one more area or am I imagining things? Oh yeah, yeah, there's over here. Okay. Yeah, they mentioned an ambush, but it doesn't look like he ambushes you. Holy hell. He's a dragon knight? Make sure nobody's coming up behind me. Okay. I was very paranoid about that. Yeah, I got one. Got one good one off. One. Okay. You're just gonna whiff big like that. We can, uh, we can, we can do this. Ha! <laughs> he tried to charge me. But what? What's the ambush part? Oh, it was just you. Sublime Bone Dust. I forgot what the Sublime Bone Dust does. Burn in bonfire to upgrade Estus Flask. Okay. I guess to upgrade the way it, um, how much it heals. Cast them into the Far Fire in Majula to increase the HP restore with each use of your flask. They say these are the remains of a saint who cast himself into the bonfire, but we will no, but we will never uh but we will never know for sure. Pursuit and ashes tell no story. Okay, cool. So we could still go fight that dragon over there. Um by fight I mean completely cheese out or we could throw caution to the wind and um run over there with master glencore again and like fight the dragon head on we could, we could try to do that but i think again we want something that could resist fire on which we haven't really uh i don't think we've picked up anything that could resist fire very well So this area isn't that scary. When you really get down to it, it's kind of scary. Not that scary. Throw two of those. So D, okay. You know what's gonna happen? Those guys are gonna ambush me. Not this guy, this guy's gone. But these idiots are gonna probably get up and try to ambush me. Oh, they didn't. Okay. I 
figure once I got over here, they try to get up and try to ambush me. Okay. This place is annoying, I remember. Wary of monster, wary of sniper. I'd be wary of both, monster and sniper. Oh, that's a doggy. Oh, him too. Oh no, you some bitch. Okay. okay. There's a couple of snipers. Go ahead and light that torch right quick. Light all these torches. Some on the bridge over there too. Uh oh. Come on. I think he's like a Ferengi warrior. Even though Ferengi is Star Trek. <laughs> Something like that. Their stuff is like the Ferengi or the Varangi. Holy hell, I'm getting tagged. Uh oh. oh. Fuck. Anybody else coming? So the archer is out here somewhere close, actually. He's going in. I think there was a torch in here. him. not have been waving my torch around like that. Okay. That's like three enemies. We gotta take shit. We gotta top off. is a player. Brady of the old guard. Uh 
Uh-oh. Fuck. Man, they should really let you cancel out of those animations. Okay. Come on over. You guys aren't gonna be able to surround me, I don't think. Rotten bodies. Okay. So him over there. He's trying to get over here, but he's struggling. I know there's more enemies above. There's some dogs around here, too. I really should be careful. Just want to face him, right? Ah, oh, shit! I should have known. Great. Should have known there was like a little caveat to that. Screw it! I'll do two of those. Oh, you were torch man. Should have kept you in there. Iron arrow. Okay. That torch is over there. this up for a little bit pick up this item I think yeah this here is death that's definitely death I do want to see over here with the torch There's no way over there. That's really all I wanted to see. Check this out already. So this is probably gonna attract them, but I do wanna see what else is in here. This is one. Oh, he he doesn't like the two, the two-handed um, R twos. I hear dogs. gonna get up that over there make sure I'm not getting ambushed I think there is an ambusher up here somewhere oh it's Luca too Okay, before I talk to you, Lucatel, you picked a very dangerous area. 
with which to conduct your business. Uh oh, I think I can still sneak up on this guy. You over there, nothing much I could do about that, but here, yeah, here I can do something about. I thought that might be you. You haven't changed a bit, have you? <laughs> a little bit. The longer I am here, the more madness I discover. A wretched place indeed, but not without traces of its former glory. What could have caused such degradation? Ah, yes. I have not thanked you for humoring me the other day. This is for you. Ah, oh, thank you. Course, so nice. No idea what it is. <laughs> She's kind of like uh, G. Like if you um if Masterless Glencore is like King Herc, she's kind of like G. Our land of Mira is surrounded by enemies and constantly at war. There is only one way up in Mira. Join the order and prove yourself in battle. My family had little fortune and no name. I had to carve out a piece of the world for myself. With two things my sword, and my loyalty to my lord. I was raised to wield a sword from birth. Life was hard, but I never gave it a second thought. I had swift success on the battlefield and quickly attained respectable stature. And then I... And then I came here to... Have you heard of the undead? These poor souls affected by the curse. An undead gradually loses his humanity until his wits degrade completely. Finally, he turns hollow and preys upon others. The hollow can never be human again. One can skirt this wicked fate only with the help of the souls found here. Assuming, of course, that the legends are true, I can only hope that they are. I'm sorry to burden you with talk of my fate. I suppose I've grown weary these days. Oh, she's not wearing her mask anymore. I'm sorry. I suppose I've grown weary. Interesting change of events. Oh, that's Dog City over there. Take this with me. Oh, I know you're gonna get up, buddy. I know you're getting up. Come on out. Come on out, idiot. Doggy, I see you. Who cool with it? On over. On over. Let's do these things. Oh man, that thrust. That thrust is ridiculous. That's a shadow dancing around. Oh, somebody's coming towards me. About to get messed up. Uh oh, they're coming. Dogs coming first. Oh, they forgot about me. Where's the dog? Is it coming around? Come on, bud. Come on. Y'all really gonna come at the same time? Okay. I'm gonna do a leaping attack, ain't he? Come on. The whiff. I work on that that those whiffs, man. It's a lot of whiff action going on. 
Okay. Well, there is another guy over there. There's probably a couple of guys up in there. Um, I'm gonna pour you out with just my face. Oh, wow. Oh, get out of here. You wear your tight spot. This here? Oh, that guy. That guy will probably run out and just start piecing me up. Okay. Hmm. Go up here very slowly. Not very quietly, apparently. A lot of pools of blood up in here. <laughs> Three of you guys. Hurrah for pointless. Is it really? Is it really though? It really is. It really is pointless. Or just view ahead. Okay, so down below us are some dogs. That guy is over there. We can do something about that actually. So again, this over here. Whoops. This over here is the two hand. Over here is to aim. This over here is to shoot. Oh, bro, you have no range. Uh oh, spider things are. Spider things know I'm here. There we go. Right. Doggies down there going crazy. Anything? Here are dogs. Are they going to try to come up here? Doesn't look like it, but I think if I walk over here with this torch, I'm pretty sure somebody ain't going to like that. I like this guy right here. That guy ain't going to like that. First and foremost. Okay. Spider, come on out. Oh shit. Okay, so he knows I'm here. I'm hearing people walking. Was that me walking? Yeah, it was me walking. And I'm being shot at. Okay. Vision of liars. Hmm. Oh, you know what? There, I think there is like a hidden something here. Oh, looks like not. I think that's actually downstairs. Hmm. Liar hit. Probably that guy down there. Okay, so up here are the freaky deaky enemies. Starting with Spider Man there. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Not really a spider, is it? Uh oh. Come on. Should have saved those. This is where a couple of them. Oh, yeah. Bleed out. Okay, that's a high amount of bleed out. 
You know what? <clears throat> oh, you too? Hold on. I'm gonna play like that. Oh yeah, look at that. I got the angle, sir. You got nothing. Oh crap. That was dumb. What? Oh gosh. There we go. I hear dogs, but I don't see any. There it is. Unfortunately, I know that there's another spider in there from the regular game. But uh, Sam wouldn't know that. He would still, of course, be extra careful. I think I'm going to be greeted by a dog soon. So I hear a lot of them. They're just below me waiting. I'm kind of waiting to see them somewhere, but I think they're just below me waiting on me. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to want to... Get two off before he gets over here. Really? He got that one off even though he was getting shot. Okay. Of course, he got that one off. Oh, okay, they're just down there waiting on me. Gotcha. Emit force. We got him down there. Uh, yeah, we might as well use all these arrows. Let's see. Dude, if he can, mm, that kind of pisses me off a little bit. Whatever, there's gonna be trading. Oh, he still hit me with that. I'm pissed. Get out of here with the bullshit. Okay. foil so in here that door looks so breakable there's blood stains in here too Hold on, you know what? Got something for this. Just for the occasion. Out. 
Come on out. Yes. Uh oh. Oh, he's pissed. Come on, that was a jump attack. There we go. Okay, Sam will still be very careful. He definitely broke through that door. I mean, that wall. Can't see shit. Uh oh. Comes another one. Okay, let him attack first. One, two. Just got hit twice. Fuck. Oh my god. Hold on. Ugh, reset. Reset. Where's he at? Come on out. Come on down. You're gonna chase me, man. Yeah, he almost fucking killed me. Okay, there's another one up there. And this this auto aim is not working out in my favor. Come on out, bro! <laughs> come on, this lock one I should say. Uh oh, uh oh, come on down. Oh, we can do this. You're gonna do it on my terms, though. My turns, mofo. Come on. You, you not know what that means? Come on. I'm baiting you out. Two. Okay. Danger zone. So that was three. Don't look like there's any more in here. Then again, you never know. There's three of these fucking things in here. Crazy. Fucking crazy. Oh god, there were four. There were fucking four. Uh, there were fucking four in that fucking camera shift, man. Like, I couldn't see shit. Come on. One, two. I'm gonna try to get a third one in there. I definitely need some more um stamina. I'm gonna get two heavies in a light. Okay, four fucking things up in this fucking house. Okay. That was everything. Now there could be... Now unfortunately, if you break the door down... Then is you break it for good, I believe. Okay, that's it. 
Where you liar wheel visions oh him he's here oh yeah no no uh gavron no wheel no deal wonder where they moved him to great sword of course sam would know about gavron but uh Ah, silver talisman. No Gavron wheel, no Gavron deal. Okay, I'm actually tired of hearing these footstep sounds, so we're gonna keep it moving. Four fucking demons in this house. Oh man, I really need to stop playing and go to sleep, but I am having a ball right now. I'm having an absolute ball right now. I know there's trouble up in there. We could take those dogs out before we get down there. I think I want to do that. But yeah, I think I want to do that. Let's see. Yeah, that should be a good shot, right? Oh, that should be a good shot. There we go. Oh, can't do nothing. Oh, they're coming. They're coming up. Okay, I think they're gonna go to distance. Hey, yeah, they're coming up. They ain't messing around. Here they come. Janky ass dogs. Ah, they could kill me. I fucking hate this. I fucking hate fighting dogs. Yep. I got both of them in one hit. Awesome. Bleed damage. Okay. Lost undead. Alright. Well, since they broke the shit, I can actually just come down here and take out Pirate Man. On over. You son of a bitch. Jeez, you son of a bitch. Come on. I just gotta hit you once. How did you whiff so hard? Quit whiffing. Quit whiffing, man. Keep whiffing so hard on everything. Okay, so that was the dogs. That was him. Okay, now we got this guy. Oh my god, I'm dead. <sighs> Fuck, man. Just just take the ass. Just hurry up. You get fucking annihilated by this dude. Hit him. I don't know why he's faster than me. I need more ADP. That's that over there. Okay. I just wanted to take those dogs out. Suppose I can go up that way, but I think I'm just going to go back around. I'm about to... This sword's about to go kaputski. Let's see. I'm going to need torch fire. I actually don't think there's a thing to light in here. Nope, it's just dark as hell.
Uh oh. Okay. Fair enough. Come on out. Two of y'all or one of y'all? Probably both of y'all. Nah. Out of your shit. came from in here, that's right. Thought that was like a new area. Why is there blood here? More bone. Jumping required. Oh, that's why. That's why. The house here. By a range battle. Oh, this guy. This guy. I'm going to the house. I want to this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What the? Oh, I'm bleeding. Oh shit. Oh shit, him too? Fuck. Hurry up. Oh, he fell off. This crazy fucking ass fell off. And all that stupid shit. Okay, let's get your ass up here. Okay. Jeez, that was almost horrible. Oh shit. Oh shit. Nah. We out. We out. Hey, what else is down here? Fucking ninja. Oh, bitch. You fucking ninja. Get out of here. Holy hell. Holy hell. Okay. Fucking ninjas, man. I don't think these guys were in vanilla. Dark Souls. Oh, I gotta light that up too. Yeah, I don't think these guys were in vanilla Dark Souls too. So we got the demons up above. I don't know if I want to mess with that. I really, I really don't want to mess with that. If I'm being completely fucking honest. Oh shit. Ah oh, fuck. All right, let's do it. There he is. Got one or two of them. Oh, you don't like the flames. Okay. They don't like the flames at all. So I can lure these guys out here. You know what? I'm gonna use a uh, repair powder. These guys are in here. Of course, I'm poisoned. Oh, wow. I think I got a cure for that. Make 
make sure my health is good. Um, what's the cure for that? I forget. I could use Divine Blessing. Uh, okay, not poisoned anymore. Alright. Fragrant Branch of your Secret ahead, then attacking. Okay. Hold on. Do it, do it. There we go. Thank you. Soldier's Ring. Don't give up, Skeleton. What's this do? Increases maximum load. I could honestly use that right about now. Instead of that, I can use this. So that'll increase my athletics. Now, some of these are poison. I don't think all of these are poison. Fair enough. Okay. So that's that. Now, this way looks like it leads to more demons. Somebody in here might know about me. Okay. Is this Gavron? Oh no. That is not Gavron. There we go. Got somebody on the next floor. Oh, that is Gavron. I hear him. Will and he deal. Ah, I think this where Luca Till was before. What I want. Gavlan, you will, you deal. <laughs> yeah. Better I use my souls with you than hang on to them and potentially lose them. But you know what? I can also sell my stuff to them. So that's, that's going to come in handy. Including, I'm not going to be using this shit. Um, or I can keep it in the inventory if I ever get an inventory. Oh, we'll sell any, uh, any of these duplicates. I'm for sure going to sell those. And two Alberts. I can probably sell like all these shields. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna use the leather shield. 
or the Parma or this foot soldier shield or the leather shield. Yep. Or the wooden shield. You know, it's one pile. It's probably better than what I got. I should probably be using that anyway. So yeah, that's fine for now. You got the cell. Increases poise. Poise, boys. Poison arrows. Poison moss, poison throwing knives. If we want to get real cheap with it, poison is definitely the way to go. So wherever Gavilon is, we're gonna to have to find him so we can get some good shit from him. Um I'll get that. And I will get all of your poison arrows. Kind okay, of sir. I'm definitely gonna to have to get cheap pretty soon. Let me get and they got four. Oh, I can only afford four. That's pretty expensive though. Um, that's pretty expensive. I think eventually these are maybe gonna become cheaper. I'm just gonna get these poison throwing knives. Alright, excuse me. Gavlan will, Gavlan deal. Gavlan wants soul. What you with Gavlan? Hmm. Gavlan with Gav what with Gav? I think that's all he says. With Gav. Okay. Many deal, many thanks. <laughs> all right, cool. I got some options going on. Okay, so I could go down there directly like this. Mess around all that stuff. Go over here. Lever, which I got. Okay, we got some more warriors in here. We got a lot of these fucking warriors in here. Luckily, only he saw me. Varangian. So I wasn't too too off when I said Varangi. It's actually pretty fucking close. Uh-uh. Oof. Thought he was about to break it. Iron arrow. Cool. That knife shard and repair powder. This is what the demons are? No, those are more, uh, Varangian. It's just him. You guys are all asleep. Okay, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I take advantage. I think there, there was some hidden shit in here too, if I recall correctly. Oh, bandit axe. Brigand hood, brigand armor, brigand gauntlets, brigand trousers. Varangian. Imported hood. And we got the brigand stuff from Dark Souls 1. Which is really good stuff, honestly. Imported hood. Trying to see if Serum would change it up. But this is pretty much Serum. The colors are just a little bit different. And actually, Saren will combine these two armors here to make the uh, Bloody Sunday's best. He would have combined something like that. 
Oh, the illusion's here? It looks like it's here. But it's not. Toggle. Okay. Oh, that probably wakes them up. <laughs> that, <laughs> I just thought about that. That probably wakes them all up. Trying to break shit and wake all these guys up. Okay, not bad, not bad. Hmm. Oh, okay. I was like, no way is that a uh creature. Killed everything over there. Okay, cool. More dogs. There's more dogs. I don't know where. Okay. Okay, I think I've seen everything over here for the most part. I think that'll kill me. Came in here and I looked at all this stuff. So, yeah, I just gotta go back up and then come back down pretty much. Then again, I could probably. I can't really tell. That looks solid, but at the same time, it could definitely be a death trap. I know there are some um, demons down here, too. That's where I have to go. But uh, before I do that, I'm going to go to where I want to go. Excuse me, got one. Matter of fact, uh, I'll, I'll come back once I got more cash. Oh shit, son of a bitch. All right, we'll just go this way. Okay, so these guys, this this is clever. This is a clever bit of level design. So you fight these guys here where there's like no light. And most people aren't gonna even try to like connect the torch light. So this, this is a genius place to put um the lack of torches, the lack of light, and then put enemies who are scared of the light in that area. That's just a stroke of genius. I mean, it's like simplistic, but it's like super fucking smart. Do it like that. Try luring it out. Okay, so this is where the demons are. Joy in death. So, lure it out where though? Down here? 
Okay. I got I should have like two. Anyway, it's fairly clear here. So down here I did I knew I saw his arm I was like I know I see his arm somewhere make sure it's not up here yet Come on up, come on up, I gotta get him up. Damn it. If I can angle it. Come on. <laughs> oh, did he like touch the light briefly? Oh, he went out into the light a little bit. On up. They both went outside to get to me, which is interesting to say the least. There he is. I think they're both down there. Come on up, come on up, man. Come on up. Oh, that's stupid. Fuck. Everything's whiffing. You caught on invisible edges. There we go. This is a horrible place to fight this fucking thing. Camera does not cooperate. Hmm. No, we ain't doing this shit on your terms. I need to see if there's another one of these down here. Okay. Or what? How are we doing this? Stuck. Bitch. Here we go. Alright. That it for this fucking room. for fucking with this shit. Okay. I actually didn't know, um, or did I? I forget. I forgot that this led here, honestly. Because I could have just lured them there. But yeah, wasn't nothing in there. I just wanted to make sure there wasn't anything important there. Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see if we can lure... We'll just, we'll just like, um, bait 
these creatures out. I think that was one in there. I thought that was something. It's because it is. Oh no. Come on up, vampire. Oh, you don't like it. <laughs> I like it. Right here. I know if I do another, he's gonna, we're gonna fucking trade. Or he's just gonna get the better of me. Come on, come on. There we go. All right, so you guys are straight up run. Pretty sure that's probably the last demon, but I think um, we definitely got some ambushes down here. No, we got some ambushes down there. Pretty sure we got one over here as well. that pretty sure we're gonna have a archer over here I guess we already killed the archer no big deal oh we can do Luka too okay you know what let's just let's just summon Luka too now, if she's here, I'll be able to do all types of stupid shit. Alright. Yep, like this. She'll be here to cover my ass. Oh shit, okay. I think there's an invader over here somewhere. There is this guy. Oh, shit. Okay. I'll put that up now. Yo. Hmm. I see light, but it remains dim. I am Carillion, and I've no interest in the magic impaired. Hmm. I need some intelligence. I see light, but it remains dim. I am Carillion, and I've no interest in the magic impaired. I think I gotta give my magic to at least like 10 or something like that. If I wanna learn his stuff. Which I think we as Serum would consider it. Would definitely consider it. Okay, there's something else over there. We can get whatever this is. Effigy and life gem. Okay, well we're already over here, so let's uh, just continue. We have danger zone.
Oh, somebody's coming. Wow. That didn't take long. Gotta be careful, there's another one coming. Anybody else? Oh, that's it. All right, well met, Lucatil, well met. But that danger zone message was regard. Whoa, was regarding uh triggering those guys to chase us. Okay. I want really anything else over here? I don't think. I do want that item. Before I wrap things up here, I do want this last item. Because I'm petty like that. Go ahead and get that item. Well, that is just what? How do I get that item? Is that here? No, that is... Where is that? Hold on. Here? Hmm. You know what, that's actually down here. Oh, you know what, is Lucatil still here? That's an interesting um, conundrum. Oh, she, she moved on. Okay, there you are. What am I seeing over there? Is that somebody that's actually alive or is that just a corpse? I think that's just a corpse. Um, excuse me. I think this here. There we go. Okay. Okay, cool. All right, now we can move on with no regrets. Get the hell out of here. Honestly, I need to uh, repair my shit. There's not a lot of um, bonfires around here. I get kind of crazy around this time of night with the cars. I really do. Actually, this isn't even where we're supposed to go to. Um, is this thing? Nah, I'm supposed to pick something up, I think. Fried bug. Fell right off. I think I gotta use this wheel over here first. 
Three message. Visions of a skeleton. I was supposed to press something. Completely forgot what that is. Okay. I'm supposed to press some type of switch, I think. If I recall correctly. You know what? I know where it is. Oh shit. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, yeah, didn't mean to do that. Uh, back in, I guess. I don't know where the hell Lucatil went. Oh, there she is. Okay, cool. I can do, uh, whoops. That's gonna hurt. Cool, I can catch back up to you. Excuse me. I think there was something about this. No? Yeah, I remember this being like a two-pronged um, thing you had to do. You had to call the boat, and then you had to get on it. So this is back down. Okay, one more time over here. Maybe he has the thing we need to call the boat over here. Doesn't look like it. I completely forgot, man. I know it's a switch. And maybe it's actually over here, but I think it's like a two-prong switch. And maybe I need the lock stone in order to do, do anything. Because yeah, this can't really do anything right now. I think I need the Pharaoh's Lock Stone. I think it has to be up here. Okay, let's try over here right quick. Just right quick. And I can't do anything. You know what, maybe, it's, maybe it was up here. get back up through here. Don't get on. Kinda scared me, buddy. So
Okay, if I get up here, then that means I can get up here. Okay, so can't do nothing with that. And do something here. Nope, can't do nothing with that. Again, this is back in here. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think that I haven't done is um use a Pharaoh's lockstone. I honestly think that's what I have to do to progress this shit. Uh oh. So I remember this being the thing that activates the ship. And oh, is it over here? No. I think it's legit this. I think I need the uh the lockstone to do anything about it. All right, well, I suppose this is as good as time as any to uh, go ahead and take a break. Um, I was hoping to actually fight the boss tonight, but um, I guess what we can do is I can just go ahead and see if that's what we're missing. I got a feeling that that's exactly what we're missing is the dang. Pharaoh's Lockstone. Funny thing is, I think this might actually be a uh, NPC. I think next time I'm going to go ahead and summon him. Okay. So who sells the ferals? That's Malinshia, right? Oh yeah, cause uh, Luca Tail's here. Okay. Thanks for the help, Luca Tail. All right, so I need at least one Pharaoh's Lockstone. But that, that doesn't really seem to be the solution. That's just the only thing I can think of at this moment. But my guess would be that that's not the actual solution, but we'll see. That's actually 4,000, excuse me. If the action. Cool, that's exactly what we need. Let's 
go on ahead. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get Bradley, and then we're going to eventually go to get Lucatel, and we're going to just run through this place. Hey, doggy. That's fine, doggy. 316. That right there is sometimes a daily number. Okay. That's fine. Shit. Okay. You out. That was so stupid on my part. That was so stupid on my part. I was, uh, I forgot if there was anybody upstairs. So I rolled back into the enemy's attack. It was very dumb on my part. And I had Bradley too. He was just taking a while to get to me. All right. That was lame. That right there was just me doing so much other stupid, unnecessary shit. All right. This could go the same way if I'm not careful. Come on. Get out of here. The dog shouldn't be a problem. I'm just gonna avoid it. This guy's here though. It, the whiffing, man. The whiffing is driving me crazy. Like, look, these guys don't fucking whiff. All right, Bradley, get your ass up here. We got some work to do. Let's go. Jump to Bradley. Oh, you got to do your salute. That's what took you so long. That's what got me killed last time, sir. You had to do your whole salute. Alright. Get out of here. Get out of here. Oh, infantry. So we can sell all that stuff. Okay, he drops down. Okay, watch my back, brother. You about to come on up. Really? What did he do? Oh, he's waiting. All right, Bradley. Sorry, up and get the Luca too. Hello. Who cares? Oh shit. There we go. Now you can use your fancy little weapon on him. How does Luca Till doing? Huh? She is. I know there's a demon right here. 
two demons. You guys gonna handle that? Yeah, I don't gotta worry about bleed like I do. Two of them down here. Doggies is coming. Uh oh. Ninja. F and Ninja. Oh, really, Bradley? Dang it. Fuck. Well, yeah, pop. Holy hell. This ain't good. Let's get in here and fight this guy. We can tell that you're struggling with. Alright, where's the ninja? How did you let him bypass you to get in here with me? Look at you. Jeez. Alright. Damn. Kinda needed Bradley to fight these demons in here. Get out the way, get out the way, get out the way. Oh, I don't like you, sir. Oh yeah, I gotta go over here to get up, to go up. I think there's demons in here. There's no illusion in here. Oh, there is. How about that? Okay. Careful, Luca, too. Fire bombs. Bloody expensive. Large Titanite. Uh oh. Just this one guy. Gavlon's not here. He went to go wheel and deal. Luca too. Luca too. Oh god, the camera and oh that was rough, man. Look at you, I need you to protect me. Okay. Okay, arrow dude is pissing me off too. Okay, we're good. We just got these guys down here. We can handle. Two. 
Come on. Allure me. Use you as a meat puppet. Meat shield. Really? Ridiculous. Alright. Oh, come on. Can you jump up there? Excuse me, look at you. Ah, uh, that sucks. Okay. Gotta go around. And do all this fighting all over again, too. I use a prisoner. Hey, can you attack the enemies that are. Assaulting me, Luke, too? You attack any of them? Can, can you do something about this? About these attacking hollow here? Can, can you do something about that attacking hollow right there? Distract them, I guess. Okay. Come on. That's my fault, but she did not even distract the dude. Okay, yeah, if you can't get through it, I don't even care what you do. Alright. Okay, let's just see. I don't think that this will be mandatory, to be honest. So it's something else I'm missing, I'm pretty sure. This just lights up this whole area. Okay, yeah, that's all this does is light, light up this whole area. Okay, so you know what else it might do? It might allow me to actually see what switches I have to actually pull. So. Come on, bitch, come on. This, this camera angle, this sword. Lucatil, all right. Uh oh. Lucatil. Almost got me killed. Please finish him off. Thank you. Do something useful. Okay, so that just lit up all this. So, with that said, with all this lit up, I don't think this is permanent either. I don't think all this light is actually permanent light. Uh oh, look at you. That's not the best place to be. 
Oh, I'm gonna I'll hit your back on that. Fuck. Fuck. Just got me killed, Luke, too. Uh oh. I can't even take another hit. Ain't you scared? He came out into light with no fear. How many of them did you kill, buddy? Let me finish that one off. Uh oh. Come on back out. Had a good run, Luca too. this here that's just you okay I just turned on all of that. Where is the switch to get all this activated? Maybe maybe everything's on the pier. Maybe every single thing we need is over here. You know what? There there actually should have been something over here. something else over here. Like torch, blood stain. Is it here? This something. What the hell? Yeah, I remember there being like some sort of switch over here. Was it up there? Maybe it was up there. Yeah, it was a switch that activated. Oh, 
I think I activated those two enemies. Unless I did that earlier. Like I already activated them. Hmm. Where the hell else could it be? That's this. This will get us up top. Yeah, it has to be over here actually. It has to be it has to be up here somewhere. Hmm. It absolutely has to be up here somewhere. Shit. Okay. Fair enough. Let's do it. Oh, I wasn't two-handed. That can actually kill me. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Gotta be up here right there it is. Oh my god. Damn, I could have used that an hour ago. Could have used that a whole fucking hour ago. Oh shit. Okay, we're gonna get bored. Before that, yeah, I'm gonna get my uh get my summons. And this will be the last thing we do tonight. I should have been asleep about an hour ago, but uh Oh, I just got wrapped up in finding that damn switch. Alright, fair enough. It's a lot of experience points. We're just gonna stack more on top of them. Gonna run over here. Get this guy out. Over here. Do that. Come over here. Do this. Okay. What else we do? Whoa, what the fuck are those guys doing? Oh, they're running away from the fire. I mean, from the, uh, Kill a bunch of these idiots. Fuck. 
he's gonna jump down there. I'm not sure I killed him already. Oh yeah, I didn't. Okay, we can get on out. I'm satisfied. I kind of want to take him out, but it's not that serious. Where's the other one at? Other one up here? Oh shit. Fucking ninja. Time for the ninja. Alright. Unless we're fighting together. Come on, let's fight this fucking ninja, guys. Oh my god. What the hell are... Okay, y'all about to get me killed. Y'all for real about to get me killed. I knew it. Bro, where are y'all at? Fucking ninja's about to make me bleed. Alright, y'all protect me or what? Okay. I'll take the ninja out. I, I can protect y'all from him. Where's the ninja go? I think they actually killed it. Okay. Very surprised y'all managed that, but uh, oh, yeah, let's go. As soon as I go over here, we got two more interlopers. Oh, okay. I guess if he comes over here, that's when he uh, decides to peace out. All right, Luca, too. All right. Okay. Well, we are definitely winding down. Oh, Luca, too, about to get into some more trouble. She is really trying to get me killed today. Can almost respect that. Can almost respect her burning desire to get me murdered. Okay, what else we got here, Luke Two? his own volition. Oh, you are not very good at the combat, Luka too. Oh my god. I got hit so hard. Um, I'm gonna have to just heal. After that one. Luka too, you aren't the best combat partner. I'm just letting you know that.
Here we go. Alright, Luca 2. See if we got everything we need. Life gems. That stuff. Mm, I got this uh, lightning as well. I think I'm going to use the dark this time. We got poison knives, poison arrows. Out of fact, I'm going to switch up. All right, let's go in here with the intention on winning. All right, let's go. Look too. Perfect. Good meat shielding, Luke. Too good meat shielding. South Century Soul. You know, she played her role exactly right. Did exactly what I needed her to do. Okay, and that's the end of that. Oh, cool. We can examine that. I'll get this first, though. Pyromancy flame and fireball. Now, Serum is nearly complete. This this was actually Serum's very first uh, ability in um, Hell's Glitch. So we we done it. We got it. I forget was it was it his left hand or his right hand? I think he uses his flame in his left hand, but I could be mistaken. Um Let me actually check. Oh man, I gotta go hunting for this thing. This thing word file. Yeah, I think it's in his left hand because he fights with his right hand normally. So I think that's that was my logic to make sure that he could uh, use pyromancy and um, wield his weapon. So I'm pretty sure he has the thing in his left hand. But let me just make sure. I got so many dang book files. Uh, it should be this one. Let's see left. Man, I used left one hundred and nine times in the book. Let's see left hand. There we go. Yep. 
the igniter is equipped to his left hand. And he is embedded in his left hand. So we will continue that on here. Pyromancy flame is left handed. And in order to use pyromancy, uh, we got to see what the requirements are to use it, because then we'll start specking into that. Pretty cool. What am I at? Like five hours? I'm at six hours. Wow. I played this for way longer than I intended. Six flipping hours. Oh, shit. This area, I remember not liking it. Nice job. Thank you. Liar ahead, but praise the sun. Weakness, hidden path. Liar ahead and short, don't you dare. Hmm. Victory, death, skeleton. Don't you dare, by the way, give up. Oh, wow. You can go that far out. I'm not about to test it. Oh, holy shit. Uh Huh. Hmm. Got a lot of souls here. Do I want to chance it? I don't want to chance it, but I feel like I have no choice here. But to chance it. Okay. I think I can just hit him and be done with it. Oh, nope. They're both on to me. But they aren't too bad. Oh, shit. Okay. I know. The poise, Jesus, get out of here, man. All that damn poise you got. Oh, that's disgusting. You disgust me. Okay. Cool, we made it. Barely, but we made it. I ain't work skeleton. Okay, so we don't exactly have easy time ahead. Um, I think this just leads up to the castle. Ain't good. Okay. We'll go pick this up. Proud Knight died in a cage. Okay. Back to the Lost Bastille from a different direction. Are you that guy who explodes? Is 
Like I shouldn't let you live. Like that can come back to bite me. Oh, you fucking ghost. See the treasure, but is it gonna lead something to me? Doesn't look like it. I'll pick this. Common fruit. Free message. Okay. Oh, there's the bonfire. Cool. I'm gonna definitely need that. I don't know if this was here before. Scholar of the first. I think that was added in Scholar of the first in. Okay, I'm gonna just go a little bit longer. Just, just, a, just a little bit. But I'm gonna go ahead and definitely use these skill points. Well, <laughs> these souls to acquire stat points. Okay, hold on. Before I do that, let me actually see. Okay, I have no attunement slot, so I'm gonna need at least some level of intelligence to use pyromancy. So I need at least that level of attunement. Four points. So I think that's what Serum would do. He would get the bare minimum for attunement so that he could use some pyromancy. Or something. So that he could have like another ability. So I think I might have to I might be forced to actually put the rest of that into intelligence. We'll see. If I could use the fireball for free, then then we'll just rock with what we got. Okay. So I can use fireball for no effort at all. That's cool. If I want to use great soul arrow, I would need 14 in intelligence. I need 20 in miracle to use that. But this one's more neutral. I could just use it. Okay. Let's just try it out. It just gives me like another another option. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't need any intelligence to actually use it, so. So what else do I want? Oh, that ups the agility rate. I think ADP. I think I want to get that to, um... 20 as soon as I possibly can.
Get some more arrows. Okay. Well, f just for curiosity's sake, I'm going to just continue exploring. Uh, at most, I'll go like another 15 minutes. did it try range battle ah there is a boss fight okay this guy's range battle anything else he's also range battle looks like he has hits harder would be my guess okay. I got gotcha. you Hmm, I don't think my fireball can go that far, unfortunately. Oh, and I can't lock on to him. And that just brings us back down here. And there's, there's actually a lot down there. Hit the fucking duck. Oh my god. This weapon is useless in close quarters. Useless. Absolutely useless. Oh my god. Two hand, please. Oh my god. Absolutely atrocious. Let me get the fuck out of here. Only I'm gonna survive. Oh, sh holy shit. Holy shit. This fucking thing is chasing me everywhere. Holy shit. That thing's still down there? He's fucking gone. Thank the Lord. Okay. As much as I don't want to deal with this right now. They're probably coming. Okay, cool. There's a lot going on in that uh, room over there. This guy is still here. Probably break that honestly. Holy hell. 
But what's happening over here? Why so many people got washed? This is where people get invaded at? Maybe. Definitely come in handy. Oh, sweet. Upgrade the Estus. check that out next time. Yeah, this was a pretty good session. I didn't think I was going to play for this long. It's almost seven hours. If I go another 15 minutes, it'll be seven hours. But I really do got to get some sleep, so. Is that a shard? Sure is. Here, let me see it. So that I may help you. To see light. To see hope. However faint it might be. I always like the fire keeper in this one, the Emerald Herald. A lot of people find her annoying, but I think she's pretty cool. Pretty rad. All right, we'll um, use this sublime bone dust here also. So that's going to be it for me, guys. Um, I'm definitely going to go ahead and clean this uh, inventory up. But for the most part, if there's something in here that I can't use, I'm not going to have it in the inventory. Eve sword, great sword. We're not gonna be using a scimitar. Um, S-Doc potentially, short sword, maybe power stancing. But I think the short swords are too short. Mm. Crossbow does a lot of damage. Like shield six. That's a too heavy.
Ah, oh, we keep the gloves. That's fine. All right. Well, we are strengthened for next time. So far, so good. We've um, we've we've died a couple of times in this episode, but in general, um, we've been avoiding death pretty well. We haven't had too hard of a time because we've been able to gank like just about every boss. Um. Yeah, we've we've been able to really summon like more characters than I thought was possible, but they they did add like quite a few more summons in this one, which is a good quality of life change because the summons are kind of um they're um optional difficulty reducing tools that like you can use the summons just to make the game a little easier. So it's cool. I like that there's more of those. Hmm. There's so much more to do. I can go in the house now. I can go in the house now next time, so we can we can mess around with that too. There's more to do. I got some branches of yours so I can actually explore over there as well. Um Yeah, there's quite a few paths open to us, so I guess um next time I get a free moment I'll just Go ahead and load this up and uh, uh oh, these things ain't no joke, man. I ain't messing around with these pigs. I already can barely hit enemies. I know, I know, I'm not gonna be able to hit these damn pigs. Oh, they're coming too. They're effing coming. All oh, these damn pigs, they can actually kill me. Okay, I just gotta hit it one more time. Oh, it's three of them. Yeah, these things hit like a fucking truck. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, you gotta fucking hit it. Don't hit it, you gotta hit it. These things give you like no experience for like all the grief they cause. No. Where's the other one at? Oh shit. Uh oh. Got a good. There we go. That's some good stuff. All right, guys, I've uh, meandered enough tonight. Um, so I hope you guys did enjoy the episode. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Um, let me know what you guys think of Hell's Glitch. Um, I know a few of you guys have um, been able to purchase the book, so I do appreciate that. I have seen the um, uptick in sales. So um, I do appreciate you guys checking out the book. Um, just another shameless plug at the very end here. For both books. Those covers are looking pretty fucking rad. Ain't gonna lie. And again, they both are uh, currently available. Um, one's available for pre-order, and that's the sequel. That's uh, Hell's of Lich Volume 2. Um, but the first one is currently available for digital download, and it's also available on audible.com. You can actually listen to the audiobook as well. So appreciate you guys for uh, hanging out with me today. Hope you guys are enjoying the uh, start of the weekend. Today is Friday. Uh, now, now is actually Saturday, well into Saturday. So hope you guys are taking care of yourselves and your loved ones. But uh, till next time, everybody. Thanks again and peace.